except for that. Are we though? Are we? Are we? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> Are we? I don't know. Arby's? I heard Arby's. Arby's. Ooh, All right, now nice. time for the big surprise. Taco's the DM tonight. Ready, set, go. Yeah. Here we go. Well. Oh yeah. <laughs> now it's a party. Welcome well, to the Thunderdome. <laughs> welcome everyone to Roll for Cake episode four, where we are having fun and trying to survive uh, trauma with humor. <laughs> trauma Stick babies. Stick so... around for a giveaway from uh, Misty Mountain Gaming. We have some gift cards, fifty dollar gift cards, hundred dollar or twenty five and fifty dollar gift cards given away in chat. So you need to go to Tannis Junior ninety three's Twitch channel right now mm -hmm. to stay in tune for that uh, giveaway. We also have a giveaway dice from Dark Crescent Studios. It is mm -hmm. a custom made roll for cake dice with a cake in it and a little D twenty inside the D twenty. It's a chunky boy uh, and uh, tacos giving away his dice that he will be playing with today so you guys need to be active on tennis junior Nineties yeah. twitch channel yeah <laughs> uh so the website for that just for those of you that need it it is twitch.tv slash t-a-n-i-s-j-r-9-3 uh but yeah you have to be there to win the thing do it do that when, when the thing do that thing. things lots of things uh, and I did just drop uh, a, a picture of the roll for cake dice into my Discord too. So if you're nice. in my Discord, you can take a look at it. And I have a giveaway as well at the end of the stream. Oh, you do? I do. All the giveaways, all of them. Um, actually, this is pretty uh, active. Sorry, my brain just turned off in the middle of that sentence, and I have no idea where I was going with it. You know, I guess I could. Either, but... I guess I could always do a custom photo set for for somebody as a giveaway. Ooh. We're having a ton of giveaways. <laughs> Just all the fucking... giveaways for everyone. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. That's gotta be. That's gotta be earned. Chat's gotta earn that. Oh, chat. Ooh, like... that gives Ooh. 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 So, so if they can earn it tonight, next session, we'll do okay. that for a giveaway. How's I, that? I could do that. Chat. Oh, there. Yeah. Damascus <laughs> laying around. I could knock a knife out for someone. Oh. The, ooh, you just oh, conveniently you just forge a knife for that. someone. Just yeah. Conveniently. <laughs> Gee, <laughs> wish I had that ability. Oh, I'll just a lifelong a heirloom blade for just someone in the chat. Yeah. Mm. I just right. throw it out there. I, uh, forging a blade is uh, forging your first blade. Oh, is such right a here. experience. Like yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi everybody, welcome to Roll for Cake. Can you tell? <laughs> right? We oh, all have at least some form of ADHD. Can you tell? Yeah. Each and every one of us. Uh, speaking yep. of which, when should we do the recap? Oh, uh, right before we play. Which Perfect. Is, which like, is probably right now. Right now. Now. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> Ivy, please uh, give the recap of last session for the. Video. I have a. I have a recap. Are we are we ready for the recap? Oh, oh I've been hydrating. Let me let me get my juice. For legal reasons, this is juice. You sound you sound like a toddler. Let me get my juice. Let me get my juice. <laughs> my boy. Hey, pour me another juice. <laughs> I I too have juice. It's just of the grape variety. That's <clears throat> juice. I can. I had juice of the agave variety earlier, but that makes no sense. It's perfect yep, yep. juice. What's wrong? All right. There? Perfect. So, uh, as everybody is aware, this is our next episode of Roll for Cake. I do have a uh, breakdown on what's occurred over the last few episodes. So now is a great time for you to pay attention if you're not caught up on the VODs. The VODs, by the way, should you want to catch up in real time, are available on Tannis' YouTube, which will be linked in the chat. So... Having helped the wizard Valexia to recover a mysterious glowing gem from an insane dryad, an undead drider, and a swarm of arachnids, our company of adventurers discovered their horse and cart missing and decided to make camp. During the night, their barbarian experienced a dream in which he unwittingly slaughtered his friends before the violence was interrupted by the Fey Lord Reynard, who eased the bugbear's nightmare. 
and the team's paladin also experienced his own dream in which he narrowly prevented a presence of pure evil from invading his mind. What? <clears throat> Excuse me. Waking the next morning, the group shared a gourmet breakfast of brick rolls before making their way back to the city of Waterdeep, where they visited the caravan court to locate Valexia's employer, a shadowy, shrouded figure that the team's Goliath immediately recognized as an aspect of the malevolent mage who had previously escaped their custody. He attacked and was promptly incapacitated by a pair of brutal maul attacks, after which the group's surprisingly sober fighter struck the figure with a necrotic arrow, and as their barbarian attempted to grapple the mage, their druid shattered the gem, prompting the figure to vanish before telepathically telling the team, you have broken the deal. Recuperating from the altercation, the paladin located a smithy where he used the fragments of the gem to craft a gilded cake of unparalleled magnificent for the team's warforged cleric, after which their barbarian purchased a set of chainmail armor for their druid. Returning to the tavern, the party was unexpectedly visited again by Renard, who offered to direct them to an item that will allow them to defeat their mutual nemesis. In exchange, for the delivery of the item to him. But before the group could agree, they discovered that their paladin had gone inexplicably missing. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, tips are appreciated. I'll be here all week. Looks <laughs> <laughs> like we had a professional do it or something. Wow. Whoa. Crazy. God forbid. Oh, as my camera goes out of focus. Great. Yeah, right. Oh, no. Um, oh, it's no, gone. Womp, womp, Come, womp. On. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Well, that is where we pick up, where you're all uh, still seated in the tavern. Um, Reynard is there and just pointed out that Joran has gone missing. Um, as you guys are all kind of looking about, um, wondering where he went. Uh, Reynard sits back in the chair. It seems your friend decided to take some matters into his own hands. I don't think I have to tell you. We likely won't be seeing him again. Oh no. Why? Because, dear boy. Joan was quite affected by the last battle. In fact, if I were to guess, he's been affected by the last few battles. He feels he hasn't done enough. And so he has made a decision. A poor one, if you ask me, but... Well, he can't have gotten too far. I can still smell him. <laughs> Would you like to try and find him? Yes. He's got a distinct odor. I can still smell it on his oh, feet. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well then, by all means. Should we uh, go after him? So you stand up. Are, are you going? Is everyone else going? Uh, ah, Bloodhound Brick, I'm on it. Let's go. <laughs> sure. Let's go, let's go find our friend. Brick, roll an investigation check. First roll of the night. Do, do, do. Don't let everybody die. <laughs> that is 11. <laughs> you um, head outside. You you start following his scent. You, you're, you're aware that you guys have spent plenty of times um, together, so you know um, what you're looking for. How long do you look for him? Yeah, is everyone with me? <laughs> Jade and I are with you. I'm oh, I'm ling I'm lingering back by the door watching. Same. What do you think? Should we go um, further? Or let him cool off, or where did he go, Reynard? He 
he went to go find metal, obviously. Maybe he has brick roll poops. Uh, given their <laughs> high fiber, that could be true. God damn it. <laughs> uh, Maybe we should let him cool off. The problem is that if Mel wants to be found, he'll be found. And in this case, there's no telling what direction Jorn would have gone. How is um, everyone feeling? With, with your with your 13 brick. Um, 11. It's, it, or sorry, 11. It's throwing you <laughs> off. Um, because for some reason, like you follow the scent outside and like down the road a little bit. But as soon as you get down to the end of the block, the scent goes in multiple different ways. How long has he been gone? <clears throat> yeah, it's been like a few minutes. Maybe 10, 15 minutes. Hey, Taco. Okay. So I can't I'm use my thinking arrow. Okay, you could. <laughs> I was just going to say, to use that fancy little thing. You, <laughs> you, <Yeah>. you could. <laughs> I want to cast okay object on uh, I mean, Is he, is he currently hurt? <laughs> is, is he doing Is he uh, in good health? You, you guys have rested since. We have. So, yeah, and a bunch of healing was handed out, so I'm sure. Yes. Go, go for it. Go for it. <laughs> wait, I didn't say that I wanted to go for it. Hold on, wait a minute. I don't, I don't, you to go for it. I don't, do you want to waste? Don't, don't waste your fancy arrows. Group hydrate. All right. Rattles wants to cast locate object on Sir Jorah's sword if it's within a thousand feet. Wow. There it is. You cast that. Uh, within a thousand feet, you do not sense it. Mm. He's a quick fricker, isn't he? <laughs> we don't is there is there anything sensed around magically that mm. could be sussed because roll, there's no way he got that far that fast roll an arcana check or do you have does anybody have detect magic I, I don't <laughs> yeah Jordan, well, did. Jordan did <laughs> uh no I think don't think he went to go find Mel I do, I do have ear to the ground, so if somebody around me saw the direction that he was going, I should be able to assess mm -hmm. that out. Um, uh, how, how long do you wish to spend looking? I'm, I'm just gonna glance around. I just need to know, actually I'll roll Arcana really quick. Yeah, we'll roll Arcana it. real quick, we'll see. Oh, did it not let me? What happened? Oh, you hit you hit a different button. Oops. What did I hit? Oh you, yeah, I did. Oh. Uh, there it goes. There, there it goes. Oh Six. wow. Wow. You unfortunately Oof. uh since no magic around. I have detect uh, magic. You do. You wish to Ooh, use it? Yeah. Sure. Uh you cast detect magic. You follow down to where like brick uh, um found where the trail just kind of splits and you do mm -hmm. sense conjuration magic mm. recently cast uh, mm. well unfortunately it seems your friend found what he was looking for mm. what was he point. looking for he was looking for Mal. <laughs> Okay. On his own, like an idiot. <laughs> he just feels... Ra Reynard, just, just on your shoulder, just... <sighs> I feel like the group should realize that he will either A, be okay, or he won't. Those are really the only <laughs> two options. Well, we're after him anyway, so we may convert paths soon. That's it, yeah. boy. Now... <laughs> Let's go back inside, since we're down a man. I believe I can call him a favor. All right. <clears throat> um, you guys all head into the tavern once more. Um, once there, um, you get back to your table, and uh, Reynard um, goes up to the bar. And if you all remember last time you were here, there was a certain uh, 
small raccoon like character <laughs> speaking with an elf <laughs> risen her up um Reynard goes and and taps on his shoulder um says a few words and then uh walks over now i would like to introduce you all to a friend of mine bodalamu uh and this raccoon looking motherfucker <laughs> steps right up you're a little one aren't you uh, i'll make i'll make it bigger this is what he looks like look at his little cape look at that it is so cute <laughs> you hey, I'm big where it counts. Yeah. <laughs> I, how much cake does this raccoon thing have? <laughs> you know yeah. what you gotta do, Bart all of you. You know what you gotta do. Did, did all right, so what is the D twenty? You sound like Joran. Yeah. <laughs> Joran. What are you doing in this small rat man? <laughs> brick, brick baby. Brick, baby. That's a long... honey. It's a raccoon. It's not. That's you know what? Yeah, it's it's a small rat man. It's fine. Brick, it's a trash panda. Never trust it. It steals your shit. Hey, fuck you, guy. <laughs> I'm confused. I think he's cute. He is cute. I got a seventeen. Hey, <gasps> ooh, yo, we're, we're just gonna be a party full of amazing cake. Not me, not and, me. And there's nope. Brick. Roll for girth. <laughs> I'm not one. I'm not your one. Brick. Um, we'll we'll get to that part. Don't worry, Taco. Um, no. Um, so with a long, extravagant bow and a wisp of my cape, I'm gonna say good evening, uh, fellow compatriots. But all of you here has owed me a favor for quite some time. I have called in that favor so that he will assist you all in your endeavor. As you drink a man's me, liquor cabinet clean one time and you owe him a favor forever. It's quite troublesome. You have no idea the amount <laughs> of liquor this thing can consume. <laughs> it was disturbing. Anyway. Um, <laughs> That's no, a sensitive no. subject. Taco <laughs> has lost his Taco's just sitting over there. <laughs> yeah. Like, the big grump. <laughs> ah, now, uh, for finally filling you in on what the plan is, there is an item, as I mentioned, near the Sword Mountains. I will be sending you all to retrieve it. This item dampens magic in a radius. All you need to do is get it near him. Better yet, if you can get it on his person, it should be even more effective. However, I will warn you. Mel, as you all are aware of, I'm sure, is not any normal magic user. I can't, I can promise that little work. I cannot promise on how long. Are we talking seconds or minutes? It's impossible to say. And what's the radius? Is it going to affect us? It will. So one of you who is um, lacking in the magical department would be best. I got dibs. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah. This is shiny. I want it. Oh, it is very shiny. Now for the downside. The item is in a cave that is well protected. Of course. Uh, how well protected? Last I checked. There was a dragon that was in possession of it. Excuse me. He's quite the cunt. You know of this dragon. Mm, what? Little rat man. Dragons. <laughs> well, he's killed me once, but it's really, really 
What does that matter? Maybe it was just fucking dragons again. It's okay. We have to kill it. Does anybody kill speak me. dragon? Do we know what color said dragon is? He is a blue dragon. So if you have anything that can protect you against lightning-based attacks, that would be best. Also, I would suggest being extraordinarily careful. Once a dragon gets in the air, the deadly factor multiplies quickly. So keep him in the cave. Was it the same one that defeated me in the rat battle? No, actually, that was oh, okay. Um, that was a green dragon. Um, uh, don't wrap, uh, don't wrap against well, a green you know, dragon. I'm a, what I'm are you doing with all these time. dragons? Well, you know. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, real quick, yeah, Brick, you are the one who wins Chatspiration. Congrats! Um, for Yay! those who don't know uh, Chatspiration, you, Chat, gets to choose one of the players who has inspiration for this session. It's either use it or lose it, and Brick, uh, one person cannot get it uh, two sessions in a row. So next session, Brick, you are, um, what's the word? Exempt. Exempt. Oh. And group hide God, y'all gotta get me fucked up. Um, <laughs> maybe I should have grabbed a bottle of water instead of juice. Peer pressure. Peer pressure. You can. You can. We need a it's not too late. Light, slightly sober dragon to fight, maybe? Hey, I have drank I, like two bottles today. Of water? Of water? Oh, okay. yeah. Especially yeah. I was like, uh, we need to have a water. chat. <laughs> we need to. <laughs> this just became Dungeons and Dragons and Intervention. Uh, <laughs> we're going to do that for you, man. Uh, I will beat you with my massive greatsword. <laughs> Ooh, daddy. Hey, give me another sword and I'll take you on. Hey, it's got a um, nice. Nice flat edge on it. Oh Jesus fuck! <laughs> wow. Some water, please. What? Yeah, oh, no water. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Get some. Okay. Get some water. Just what? Drop this little gym, okay? I'm so gonna go get water. In the chat, yeah, I said, go, uh, go do that. A dragon, and Thorin, son of Thor, said. Isn't that pretty much how shout battles work in Skyrim? <laughs> it's true. <laughs> I'm not mad at you, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> to be fair though, can you imagine if like, to be fair. like the kids, to be fair. The kids be fair. Eat, <laughs> your first time doing a dragon shout? Have you seen that meme where it's just the cat screaming? <laughs> That's a mood. Whoa. Me too, cat. Group hydrate? I shouldn't have. Oh, right. No. Much. Another one. Yeah, oh, no. there's another one. Yeah, there's Who's another one. Guy? Hey, straight whiskey, guys. That's uh, apple juice. Was you were doing apple decision. juice. It was a bad plan from the start. So <laughs> this, this dragon has the shiny. I regret nothing. Boy, is he bad at math. <laughs> the dragon has the shiny. Yeah, and the dragon wants to be shiny as well. The shiny. But. Okay. It's not terribly far. It is up in the mountains for some is of it, you who are unfamiliar old? with that kind of terrain. It is can it be a little rough. No, is it an old dragon? <clears throat> is it a baby dragon? Is it's it like... a, he, he's not quite ancient by any means, <laughs> but he is no hatchling. Okay. What are his weaknesses? Sides, I have faith that you can more than likely probably handle it. Oh, I, I trust your judgment. I don't. It's such a nice <laughs> fucking trash you panda is going to be a problem. What's so good about the trash panda? The trash panda is really the only songs. way we have to handle things right now. Okay, listen up, short shit. Okay. <laughs> You're the same size. It wasn't always a trash panda, okay? I was made into this immortal form of a raccoon. Not and how did me. that? How did that happen? Some douche canoe is in purple pants named Mel Gibson or some shit. Mm. Got pissed off at me because I was risen up his his lady, okay? And they did some little magic fucks, and then poof, I'm a I'm a fucking four foot tall, furry trash panda. Mm. Huh. That would. 
That would cause issues. So don't make him like into him. a hat. No. You can no. wear me like a hat. No. Oh. And, and here we go. Oh. I'm not into raccoons. Ooh. So are we getting this shiny for you or is it for us? Well, this item will help you defeat Mel. And as for um, Ivy's comfort, we made a deal. If you are successful, you will bring the item to me, and that's what I will get out of this exchange. Oh. I'm all about Ivy's comfort. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. Aww. And what happens <laughs> if we lose? And Mel gets this item from us. We die. He's not going to. Well, then, all of a sudden, it won't be your problem, will it? <laughs> That's not a question. It's not going to happen. I'll find other ways to deal with it. Have you ever content. tried to send Sorry. somebody after this item before? No. <laughs> oh, great. So we're your test rats with a fucking pizza stealing bandit that covered hey. in fur. Hey, awesome. he's the rat chat, okay? That's racist. <laughs> <laughs> That's radish. I don't know if it's well, racist, it's it, D&D. Technically, it's <laughs> is, But like, is it? does it count if you were transformed? I feel like there's a lot of stipulation here. Maybe we should just, you know what? Let's Fuck go. It. Let's go fight Let's a dragon. It. I'll just, yeah. Huzzah! <laughs> Which way do we go? Uh, uh, northwest <laughs> of here. Which way is that? <laughs> I, baby, I it. Okay, Rick, okay. I, I got it, honey. I'll take. Don't worry about it. Just, I, uh, oh, it's good. It's Follow good. I got and you'll be fine. Oh, that's <laughs> a great idea. I love this it. It's gonna be awesome. Is Randall's <laughs> on? You can't hear me. He hasn't said a word. Is he sleeping? <laughs> With he's that beautiful there, booty. He's just sitting there holding Jade. She's just taking a nap. And... <laughs> Soft She's kitty, born nap. kitty, little ball of fur. Oh, God. <laughs> That's nice. In, like, the robotic voice, just... That's so Soft nice. Kitty, yeah, I don't kitty. <laughs> okay, I was worried. <laughs> Man, a little I'm ready. bit of a trip. Uh, the distance to the mountains isn't horrible. You've all seen the mountains off in the distance, I'm sure. But the mountains themselves can be a little treacherous. You all know that this world isn't exactly the safest place. There are creatures and denizens, always waylaying travelers and adventurers. But I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay. Damn fuck. Let's go. <laughs> well, I believe a good night's rest would be a would be in order before beginning such a interesting adventure. I lean over to to uh, that fey creature and say, "Hey, before you go, could yeah. you wash the bugbear one last time? He uh, got a little rider on him." Oh, that's right. He's got all the spider guts on him. So <laughs> crusty <laughs> and dried up. And... I will. I will trade you a full, brand new bottle if you please just, just give him a bath. Absolutely. And just. Okay. Um, oh, that is nice. Uh, 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 <laughs> this time he smells uh, like. What was the last? Time? It was lavender. lavender last time. Lavender last time. Uh, now he smells like roses. Oh. That's, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, All there right. we are. My rose. That time of break. He holds his hand out. Who has the thing? So I, I reach over from behind the bar with the bartender sitting in front of me and grab a bottle to hand to him. Ah, anything for a bottle of this. Toodaloo, everyone. Sleep well. Don't die. And he just pops the cork and walks out the door drinking it. That tracks. Cool. Nice. 
as he uh, uh, goes through the door, before the door even closes, he's gone. You know, that door almost hit his ass on the way out if it weren't for the fact that it was so bubbly. <laughs> the door would have bounced right off. Recoil? You can bounce a gold coin out off of that thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, you all uh, um, have had a very long, very tiring, very emotional day. Head off to bed. Um, Brick sleeping outside in the dirt. No, oh you just got he was water. just you clean. Just clean. clean. You just had a bath. <laughs> it's like a mud bath. It's cleansing. <laughs> I'll go about my nighttime shenanigans. Mm. Um, roll, roll a charisma check for me. Everyone, nighttime shenanigans. Nope. Uh, Bartholomew. Bartholomew. Uh, 18? Yeah, you have a good night. <laughs> <laughs> that elf comes back. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, Valexia. However much money you want to spend. What? <laughs> for your I thought you wanted the gold, the gold for a good night. That's the whole reason. Oh, gold, did, right? uh, oh you Unless did. Unless she wants another right. one. Yeah. I mean... That's I'm gonna sleep good. Yeah. You you understand you could just not spend the money and get the same thing for free, right? It's too late. I love how I said nighttime shenanigans and he goes immediately to prostitution. I'm a fucking trash panda. I was literally going out for trash panda things. Like yeah, he was gonna oh, go steal I, no, I went with hard things. So I assume. your mind went to that. My mind oh, went to wrapping everything I own to my boss. <laughs> <laughs> Tacos in his bed, just hugging his his backpack. Like, Hold on, the, bro. Is the, the rope is tied around. Um, <laughs> but in your mind, all I hear is that little patter outside the door. <laughs> oh okay, my god! That's great. Yeah, that's Good god. It's a bit much. Um, in the night. <laughs> Pause for dramatic effect. Uh. Ivy. Uh oh. You find yourself awake. Mm. Oh, her mommy. You get up out of bed and walk out of your room. You walk towards the window and open it. You're on the second floor. For some reason, you don't have any fear. You step out of the window, and gravity doesn't take you. You find yourself slowly floating towards the ground, landing softly. And you walk uh, to the back of the inn. Um, real quick, Brick, you said you'd slept outside. Where specifically? Uh, around back. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to have you roll perception. Uh, that is a 12. 12? Well, okay. Currently, you are still comfortably asleep, <sighs> playing with foxes in your dream. Fuck. Uh, roll, roll a d20 for me real quick. Just straight d20. <laughs> Nat 20. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Go come around. Stress um, situation. I'm stressed. You find <laughs> yourself, Ivy, walking towards the stables, which are, um, in, there's the back of the inn, there's like a dirt path, uh, and then Stables. Um, the stables. You do see, like, disturbed earth over to the side where you know that's where Brick is sleeping. But no part of you even thinks about going to check on him. You instead walk directly towards the stables. Inside, you see a man with a horse brushing it down. A large, 
Midnight Black Mare. Oh, baby. The man turns, and you recognize him instantly. Good evening, my dear. It's wonderful to see you again. That's a word for it, isn't it? You realize you're answering, you're talking. Mm -hmm. But you cannot move. Seems you had an interesting day meeting new friends. A few, I hear. What do you want? What? I can't have a simple conversation with an old friend. You and I both know how most of our conversations have gone in the past. He turns from the horse and walks and stands right in front of you. Yes, I remember very well. Tell me, this new fey friend of yours, what do you make of him? Why is it relevant to you? That does not matter. What matters is that I wish to know. I'd like you to make a wisdom, or sorry, double check. Wisdom saving throw, please. Yeah. Please, 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 please. 14. You do wish to answer him. He's looking for an object. It's at this point in time. You hear like the crashing of of some metal. Trash cans, maybe. Bartholomew, you're over on the on the side of the inn. Um, You start hearing voices over at the stable. And okay, do I recognize the voice? You you're hearing Ivy talking. But only Ivy. At the moment, yes. Okay, I'm gonna uh, meander that way. Are you going stealthily, or are you just oh, walking yeah. right up? No, no, no. I'm 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 creeping. Okay, roll stealth check, please. <laughs> Eleven. <laughs> you hear about three more uh, 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 trash cans fall over, and then <laughs> as a cat Maybe runs I'll away. <laughs> <laughs> do, do any of us wake from the disturbance in the night? You know what? That was uh, mm, that was loud. Uh, everyone, uh, ro- just roll d twenties. Except me, right? We're just going straight four. <laughs> Everyone who's sleeping, just straight D20. 14. 14. No. 19. Ooh, Ooh. skate. Six. Hey, Alexia, Ooh. yeah, you are awake. Not that she probably wasn't anyway, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a minute, honey. I want to check what that was. Uh. Uh, what'd you get, Taco? 15. And brick, six. Fucking brick, brick. You baby. Are now, buddy. No. He's down. He's hey, down let's, there. let's be real. I'm it was a rough night mind. last night. <laughs> it, it, it was a rough night the night before. You're catching up on that snake, man. Oh, he's doing something. I love how you're the closest one, <laughs> and you were just hearing nothing. He's fapping. Um, uh, Taco, you are still asleep. Right now, Valencia, you. you are the only one that wakes up to that. Good, um, good God, okay. Uh, you do hear voices outside in the stable. Uh, you do recognize Ivy's voice. Um, Ivy, um, an item. How interesting. Where would this item be? 
Go ahead and, and make another wisdom check. Fuck. Ah. Roll high, girl. Roll high. You know oh, what's man. sad though? What's sad though is if she had advantage on either one of those, they would have been nat twenties. <sighs> Stop it. That's rough, buddy. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry, Griffin. No, you're not. No, you're what? fucking not. Do I'm not lie to me. I, I am. I am. You Mel, are. Mel thinks it's funny as shit. I'm not gonna lie. Fuck. You, you get the good thing is you want to answer and you want to answer truth, truthfully. But you can be as vague as you want. There is a place underground, decently far away from here, but it's in. I see. Bartholomew. Oh, I'll, I'll get to it. Uh, oh, there. Um, you say this. Um, Bartholomew, you reach the stable. Valexia, you look out the window. Uh, and you see uh, Bartholomew uh, approaching the stable, and mm -hmm. um, Ivy is inside as well. Um, okay. You look in, and you see Ivy standing completely still, eyes closed. Well, as if she's asleep. Hmm. Probably sleepwalking. I... Yep. Appreciate the information. It seems your new friends wish to check on you. You, you, you cannot keep doing this to me. The beauty of this, my dear, is that I can. Uh. Till our next encounter. The next thing you know, Ivy, you are standing in the stable. And you turn and look, and Bartholomew is standing there looking at you very confused. Holding a spoon. Mm -hmm. Holding a spoon. I, I shake myself a little bit, kind of focus, completely mask anything that I've got going on, and just fixate on the spoon. Just late night snack, or... Hmm. I'll give um, Ivy go ahead and roll a deception check and then Bartholomew roll an insight check. Oh, fuck me. To, to try and. Because <laughs> your rolls are doing good. Good luck on that tonight, roll. Okay. <laughs> 15 and a natural 20. Nothing's wrong with her, dude. <laughs> confused about that? About that spoon. Ugh. Yeah, out for a midnight stroll, are we? Uh, sometimes I sleepwalk. Um, I can't control it, so. Fair enough. Sorry. <laughs> and then I start to walk back towards the inn. In the morning. Unless you, uh, Bartholomew, if you wanted to say anything else. Are you just letting her go? So she, she just walked by me, right? Mm hmm I'm going to do an investigation on that dump truck. <laughs> go for it. <laughs> go for it. <clears throat> oh, he... She doesn't have much. She doesn't have much? It's average. Well, uh... nine. So not really. It's average. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just gonna go about my non-sleeping business, so I can't, because I can't sleep. He gets pegged in the face with a rock. Fuck! <laughs> 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 uh, the next morning comes. You all wake up, have a quick breakfast. Um, you see, uh, um, in your pack, brick, as you are. You make your brick rolls for the day, ready, ready to go for everyone. Um, Tommy, and you're and you're stuffing them in your pack for for later use. You see, inside is a map. Oh. 
Um, so there's a group hydrate. Ouch. Uh, the map uh, leads, like, uh, like yeah, Reynard said, up to the northwest, and there is a small, like, hand-drawn fox in, in the mountains. Hmm. Or go hold it up and, like... Can somebody read this? I feel funny. <laughs> uh, you grab Anyone? the map. Uh, whoever, whoever wishes to. I'll take it. Uh, you grab that and you uh, turn it over um, in flowing, beautiful handwriting. Damn, he Just writes better than I do. All get lost. R. Mm. We would get lost, wouldn't we? <laughs> We're all lost. Might come across an empty camp and spend half a day looking at it. On you look back at the map. <laughs> <laughs> it says it says underneath PS. Yes, you would have. Um, <laughs> <laughs> He's lucky I like him. Cha chaotic. Yeah, I Yes, baby brick. <laughs> Look, I'm just like rattles. And he'll hold up his hands. And as you see, <laughs> there is blood dripping down his forearms and you'll notice green gems sticking out of his hands oh god yeah buddy look um fuck and she scrambles to get into her pack to find something to mm -hmm. wrap his hands I, I would assume you got some medical stuff in there you pull out some bandages yeah. Um, you start wrapping his hand. At first, you're like you're being very careful, uh, and then you notice he's not flinching at all. Can... Aren't you proud of me, baby? Oh. I, I'd be proud of you no matter what. But you you can't. You you want to be you want to be brick. You don't you don't want to be somebody else. Well, oh, that the, makes my heart. The, the gem said it could help me, like it helped rattles. I know, but but that's that's Rattles' thing, right? You you have other really amazing abilities that are just for Brick, and that's the thing that we need to focus on getting better, right? We we don't want to be like someone well, else. Wasn't strong enough. And oh Jordan, God, he's gone. Feels. That <laughs> mess. I've never had that happen before. Well, everyone gets hugged. That guy just stood there. She 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 stops and she holds she holds his hands gingerly, and she takes her hand against the side of his cheek and rubs her thumb on it like you would a kid, and she smiles at him. Sometimes we have bad days, and sometimes we aren't strong enough to deal with the things that we need to, and it's okay that we can't. It doesn't mean we can't get stronger or have really good days where we just are amazing and, and can do anything, right? You have those days. You are that guy. But sometimes it's a bad day, and it doesn't mean that we need to do something to get better because of that bad day. We just have to accept it as a bad day, okay? I, th I thought it could help. <laughs> Can we all hear this? Yeah, you guys are just sitting. Oh yeah, I'm, uh, I'm about this but shit. Probably so. at this point, outside the. Um, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna sneak yeah. up behind Ivy and I'm casting unfailing inspiration. Oh shit! Oh. Mm -hmm. I I would like to throw out there, y'all coming at me for for emotional shit, and here comes oh, Ivy, ready to make fucking everybody cry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it secretly though. I'm not gonna. Okay. She's I, being I, a mommy. You killed a cat. There's a fucking difference. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. I mean, I mean. You did. Yeah. yeah. So she uh, she finishes wrapping his hands, and she gives him a really light kiss on the forehead. Brick, honey, 
There is nothing in this world that you could do to disappoint any of us. Ever. And you are so strong and so wonderful, and we are so lucky to have you. And that's all that matters. Because your best some days is just what it is, right? I guess so. We got this. We're going to do this together. And then she ruffles his hair on his head. <laughs> and backs off. And you'll uh, see Brick very frustrated, like just frustratingly confused and just. And just kind of punch the ground. But as you see him lift his arm out of the ground, there is a stone maul head on his arm. Look at my baby being a badass. <laughs> the gem said it would help. I, uh, you know what? I, it's going to help so much. <laughs> and you'll see faint trickles of blood underneath come down. Mm. But, so worth it. So well, this might come in handy, I suppose. <laughs> He's got a rock fist now. Awesome. <laughs> Fucking dope. <laughs> Let's rock this shit. Hammer. Okay. hammer! He's got a hammer! Uh, so, you all uh, start heading off. Would, does anyone want to stop at any shops or anything? Get anything you think you might need? Um, How much do we have left? Uh, what, what's our gold count? Uh, 724 gold, one silver, and four copper. Okay. Well, <laughs> this many shinies. <laughs> And whatever oh, Valencia has. Uh, yes. um, <laughs> do I have? I will say real quick uh, uh, for spellcasters, drop a gold and that'll cover all of your magic shit. Okay. Uh, you, you, you do, no, you do the good. quick normal shops. Yeah. Um, you are going into the mountains. So. <sighs> Uh, and you were also told that uh, blue dragon. Need um. Oh, uh, lightning resistance potion. Lightning resistance stuff. <laughs> um, I need um. I need ball bearings. Easy enough. Like oh shit. Look all the way back. What do you have, you little furry rat? A damn thing. Fuck off. Ball Fuck off. <laughs> um. <laughs> If you guys can't get along, I'm putting you in the back seat and making you wear the get along shirt. Oh, please, mommy, do. The gem do said it. I have everything that I would ever need. <laughs> what do you guys want? I have lots of shinies. Um, mm. Ball bearings Ooh. are easy enough to get. Um, one one gold for a bag of ball bearings. Thank you, thank you. Mm. Also, Dad, when all the kids like went straight to sleep. Oh fuck! Nice. That's right? awesome. I don't know. Do what we want fuck horses or a cart or something. How much would a ring of lightning cost? You still have a horse and cart. <laughs> or no, that was gone. That's yeah, right. that's gone. Yeah, that's kind of a bitch stole our damn horse. Whoops. Yeah, ring anything of lightning resistance, like ring of um, lightning there's, resistance. There is no, like a, an apothecary shop that sells potions what? and shit. What? So I will I will dip into the apothecary. Um, it's this old guy, mostly bald, wisps of white hair. Um, he's missing like three fingers. How you doing, uh, Daddy? What's up? He's got hey. like three teeth left. <laughs> oh yeah, gummy baby. <laughs> okay, but what does he roll? That's gonna get clipped. Uh, <laughs> Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Roll it. Can I, Roll it, can I come with I'll you, come with Ivy? 16. Nice! For all, for all who need to know. 16. Always, baby. <laughs> dude, this is a whole ass city just caked up people, It's been dude. a while since I've had someone that looks like you come in here. God, this old man's got Riz. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah? <laughs> oh, no, oh. <laughs> You guys made funny noises. Okay, uh, okay. Wrestling. <laughs> it's wrestling, my guy. What can I do for you? So, uh, I, I I lean over the counter and I start looking at some of the wares. Do you do you have anything for for lightning resistance? Ooh, 
What are you hunting? I hate what my mouth does when I do this voice. I can't not do it's it. It's awesome. <laughs> I, I'm purposely not looking. <laughs> it was like John Dustin. Shut the fuck up! Alright! <laughs> I got my own insecurities that I'm dealing with! Hey, you're doing great. Lighting resistance. I don't fucking know. Um. Well, let me see if he's got one. Hi ya! Shit, he does. Oh! Uh, he has <laughs> three. Oh! Uh, well, that'll do. Oh, yeah. Let's see. How many shinies? Uh, 200 gold a piece. A piece? Uh, hey, these, Come on. These things isn't cheap, all right? Didn't you, but, but if I buy all three, I mean, I'm sure you could work something out with us, right? <laughs> Roll a persuasion check. Oh, man, my charisma's in the trash. Let's see. <laughs> please, 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 please. I'll skew it. Oh, no, my God. Oh, I ain't skewed that much. Is she, dis is she distracting? Uh, um, what is Ivy wearing? Jokes. You're good looking, but I got a, I got a business to run. Fuck. F uh, 50 off. Come on, please. We're, we really need this. Yeah. All right. Can Rattles twerk? Let's <laughs> wonder and just blind him yeah, and then rob him. blind him and take it. Blind him and rob him. Brick will go wait for the distraction and then try and, with his big long oh. arms, swipe. Roll a swipe of hand. He needs to earn his keep. Ooh. I'm walking in and I ask, uh, uh, you got any potions of invisibility back there? R rattles, roll performance. performance. Just walking in, roll performance. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Performance. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Make that cake work. Here we go. Work it. Work it. 18. Woo! Oof. I, I got a 17 for sleight of hand. Another group Damn. Another t Damn. I'm All glad right. you guys are rolling decent. I, I specced into sleight of hand. <laughs> roll, uh, roll a D8 for me, tank. Four. Four? Oh, shit. Oh, all right. Cool. Um, you reach down, you just grab a potion uh, and you quickly put it in your pouch. Um, I don't know what it is. I just grabbed yet. it. Okay. Um, Rattles, you walk in. He just... Not even hiding it. He's checking that shit out. Uh, Potion of invisibility, you say? I nope. got one of those. What? Well, while he's it? in the middle of being distracted by rattles, I slam 150 down, grab the other two, and just walk out. Can I do How the, much uh, for the, can I do the potion, potion of invisibility? Yeah, that's a good 2,000. 2,000? I want to rob this guy so bad. I turn around <laughs> like I'm thinking. That's a lot of And, uh, you know, I give him a good back view. Damn. And then, uh, all of a sudden, my cape <laughs> flies straight up like a peacock. And I start throwing it back. Wow! Oh, the thunderous Perfect. clap of the Thunder. magnificent cheeks. Thunderous oh. clap. Because oh, wisdom oh, is oh, your oh, spellcasting oh, modifier, just roll a wisdom check. Well, he's got the cope of billowing. He does. This is that. That's one reason it's why this is working. Yeah. Sixteen. Oh my Good god. Good fucking god. All oh right, my now. god. So I have to make a check against sixteen. Why is this working? There's my rolls. They're back. No. Fine. No, it's my rolls. My normal rolls. I didn't use your dice. I used the penguin one. <laughs> that's a four. Um. <laughs> Uh, Taco, are you in there with them? Yeah. While this dazzling light show oh, yeah. is going? Absolutely. Roll, roll slide of hand. 17. Oh, roll low. 17? Yeah. Do I yeah. add? What, what do I add? Uh, uh, so look at the big long box with the skills. 17. 21 total. 21. Oh. You swipe uh, uh, a potion. <laughs> roll a d8. Oh, roll a D8. Hold on. We'll see which one you got. 
Six. You son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, uh, you swipe it and and you start heading towards the door. You look at Rattles, give him a wink, and, and you head on out. Uh, this guy is just sitting there, just fucking amazed at this dazzling display of despicableness. Um, Does he have an erection? <laughs> Roll. Don't worry about that. Roll. <laughs> We're rolling. rolling. Rollies. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. We made that old man's day, baby. No. Three. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, he does. Um, so, you I all head out. 150 gold. Um, so, uh, you guys have two mystery potions, and then you have the, the three lightning because you grabbed the other two you didn't pay for them though we grabbed yeah, the other two. Y- y'all fucking robbed this old man blind hey we um, did more than I, you look, know i hey, i we, did not rob him i gave him a show <laughs> he paid um, in different payments yeah yeah he got he got his payment. that's true he got Consider paid credit. in cake um <laughs> now you can't you can't upgrade weapons, right? You have to either purchase weapons or you have to forge weapons. In a way, you may. What are you looking to do? Well, currently I, I have a longbow, and if it's a fucking dragon, mm-hmm. are you I'll run it. It's fine. Like a, Don't worry like about a it. Plus one. I have a cleric of the forge. Kind of thing? Yeah, I mean, there's like. Bone bows and arcane bows and like other bows. Yeah. Um, I'm a clear but the forge. we just spent feel... 150 of our good? coin because somebody doesn't like to steal. Hey, we stole. We got a deal. Three I let you get away resistance. with it. Calm down. You um, told me that you would put baby in a corner. For, Nobody puts baby in a corner. For 500 gold, if you went to uh, a blacksmith shop, there is a plus one bow. What do you think, Taco? Do you need it? You want a new uh, yeah, we'll be thing? good. We'll be fine. Five. I, otherwise, we're gonna have to do this whole thing all over, and then I'm gonna have to take girth and helicopter, and it's just <laughs> it's not gonna be good. Listen, we don't want to hurt people. Okay. So, so is this is this someone who would take trade? Maybe. If I, because I have quite a few weapons. If I traded almost all of my weapons, except, except my dagger, would they give us the bow? Roll a d20. 15 or higher, sure. Please, 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 please. Keep your... Oh! Oh! It's fine. I mean... Ouch. What if I had what if I had a gold on top? Well, I'm not, nope. Nope, we're not giving gold. Production inspiration, huh? Chat, chat, do we allow production inspiration? Or or I can pass. Do we allow the guys behind the scenes? No, 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 no. no. Listen to me, first of all. As the resident Santa of subscriptions, I think that that's a fair rational thing yeah. to do. I'll allow it. Mm-hmm. I'll chat allow says it. yes. Chat says yes. Allow it. Thank you, chat. God damn it. Tell them that Roll they're again. good boys and girls. Tell them that they're good boys and you girls. Clip it, clip it, clip it. boys and girls, aren't I'm, you? I'm going to help this role. I'm going to help. How do I help? I'm going to aid. <laughs> it's it's all right. You, you, got, you have the plus one longbow. All right, so <laughs> you all motherfuckers, all right. I gotta, I gotta get rid of, rid of all my weapons now, though. Great. What did you, what did you, not your blasting? Keep that low blasting. Oh no, 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 no! That goes nowhere. Yeah, no. That's, that's special to me. <laughs> Give her everything. That was a gift. Uh, Where's it at? Mm-hmm. Who wants um, these special potions? Sorry, excuse my clicking. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you're fine. Uh, you're fine. <laughs> Ivy. Yes. What were your items that you were given for the first episode? 
Uh, I was given my circlet of blasting. That's that's what I was given. Is the ring of jumping attuned? Yeah. Yeah. It Double is. Checking. Yes. I have it in my inventory, and I took it. So yes. Yeah. What about the rope of entanglement? You can, not. Un you can unattune as well. I could give yeah. the rope of entanglement with the queef missile deluxe yeah. word. Yes. I would like to give that to Ivy. Oh, okay. Cool. You have the rope of entanglement, whose magical word is queef missile. Great. Is this a? Uh... Does that mean we're friends? No, it's just I don't like owing anybody, so take it and smile. Tell her she has to say it sexy for it to work. Yeah. Oh, you do right. have to say it kind of sultry when you say queef Ouch. missile. How much? Um, someone do math. How many bits is like 50 bucks? Uh, I don't even know what I'm bit. doing here. <laughs> don't ask me to do <laughs> fucking math. A bit is one cent. Do math. Oh, two thousand. It's there yeah. Someone, if if someone gives two thousand bits, that's twenty bucks. Wait, 50, that's twenty thousand. bucks. Fifty thousand. Fifty thousand. Five thousand. Five thousand. Jesus. Wait. People are throwing numbers <laughs> at me, man. I don't know what's happening. Jesus, fuck. There's like three three group hydrates right away. We gotta put a limit on this thing. We're all just gonna be spending the whole time drinking and going to the bathroom. We're just thirsty as fuck. It's fine. So who wants these fancy potions? My my um, my little rock told me I don't I, I don't need it. How how about you let me take them, baby? Okay, uh, you can have it. Does anyone have identify? Uh, yeah, that's on everybody else. I think Alexia might. All right, finishing my thought. If someone spends fifty bucks uh, worth of bits, uh, we'll find a way to get Tank to say fuck. <laughs> Wait, the F U C K or the P H U C K? F U C K. It's gotta be explicit. It's gotta be a straight up. Fuck. Break frick you, Dennis. Break frick you. <laughs> Five thousand bits. All right. Yeah. Do we do we have identify? Did we? Turn? I don't know. You're muted right now, uh, Allie. Hello. So. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Do you have identify? My character sheet is not loading right on this. Um, Give me a moment. I got this. I'm the DM. I mean, I should, right? Yeah. yeah. Da -da -da. Just, da -da -da. It's just loading. Ritual Detect spell. magic, mage armor, sleep, shield, fairy fire. You do not. Mm. Womp womp. I messed up. Oh! Now, the question hey. is, this is like one yeah. of those PG-13 movies, right? Where do we use the placement of we, Yeah, we word? have one fuck. So far. So, so far. far. Are, are you willing really, really to do we'll, more? We'll, more we'll, we'll bank them. Yeah, we'll see we'll when it's an appropriate shit, time. Guys, it, you all heard. We it'll happen during shit. the game, so don't worry. Stay tuned, you know. <laughs> you son of a biscuit. We do have a dragon. <laughs> a coming up. Uh, he, you're, you're going to be in like so many situations. Something real big is happening. You're going to be like, oh, what the Ricks? <laughs> Uh, are you going to give edge their inspiration to them or to them that day? The person? I don't know. Um, also, uh, do we just not know what one potion is? There's two po the one you got and the one Taco got. Oh, okay. So, so there's not just there's just not a label on these bottles. This old man is that senile. He's old as fuck. Can I investigate uh, the bottle? You can roll Arcana to try oh, and figure uh, out what it is. No. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> uh, 16. Oh. 16. No, Norris with a 20. Norris. Damn. Walks up. Uh, 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 picks the one from Brick, takes a look at it. You, you slosh it around, you sniff it. This is a potion of heroism. Oh. Hmm. That's 200 gold right there. 800. Sorry. 800 gold. Um. So... 
So you fucking for straight one hour after drinking, you get ten temporary hit points for the same duration. You're under the effect of the bless spell. Holy mm. moly! Yep. I like that. That's nice. Uh, the other potion, uh, Bartholomew. You seem to be the potions expert here. Roll another Arcana check. Oh! <laughs> Bartholomew is just like a potions master, just like I know my drink, fucking yeah. Snape in the house. <laughs> he knows his drinks, man. Uh, is this Snape. is in fact that a potion of invisibility. There you go. You robbed this guy for eighteen hundred gold. So, so hold up, right now I'm invisible and I'm super hyped up. With no, the no, no, you, you just knew what these no. potions did. Okay, okay. So um, we only got we only got two potions, or we got three. We got uh, resistance. So three potions of lightning resistance were purchased. Yeah. Well, one. one was purchased, two were stolen. Um, but, so 400. So you took this guy for 2,200 gold. Not that I'm going to remember that. Fuck that guy. At all. We needed so it. So I, uh, I take the potion of invisibility and hand it to Rattles since he wanted it. All right. Um, nifty thing. Um, Jade walks up. And she has two potions with red liquid inside of it. You all recognize these as potions of healing. Oh. <laughs> Sweet Great. baby. None of you saw her, because I roll a natural 20 for her stuff. <laughs> <laughs> While you guys were all like trying to distract and steal, she walked right the fuck in, took what she wanted, and walked right the fuck out. Are Fair enough, baby. Minor <laughs> healing or like big healing? Uh, they are uh, regular, so it's 4d4 plus 4. Okay, so who's um, got what? I've got the heroism. Okay. And then Rattles has the invisibility. Okay. Uh, Ivy has three of the lightning resistance, and Jade has two potions of heal. Correct. Yeah. She will hang on to one, and she will give the other to Taka. Yes. Why do I, why do I need one? What do you have planned for me? <laughs> she hands it to you, and she says, "Thanks for protecting me in the last fight. Now Aww. I don't owe you anything." Oh, gross! Right. Tit for tat. I'll take it. Uh, right. So you have a uh, potion of healing. I don't need any of that resistance. My magic little rock that I talk to tells me no. Yep. A greater healing potion. Thank you. Um, oh god, another group hydrate. Jesus fuck, everybody. Fine. It's okay. <laughs> Not a problem. Really? Everybody <laughs> chug. Just just chug for five seconds. What? Is this the last one we're gonna do? Sure. For now. You might turn it on later. I'm Damn. sipping. I'm, I'm doing sips. <laughs> <laughs> Hang in there, Mark. Hang in there. You need some tums? <laughs> you All right. that, it's um, it's the Zevia version of Sprite, so a little oh, bubble. Oh. Mark, Mark, roll a con save. Not rattles. Oh my Mark. god. <laughs> oh! oh! That's, two That's two fucks yeah. given. I gotta make sure the math's right I've... on that. Is that 50? Is that for sure? I don't know. Uh, 5550 bits is a hundred dollars. 5,550 five, bits? 5,550 five, 5, bits is one hundred dollars. Oh. So that's uh, like... 5,000 bits is, is whatever it is. Okie dokie. <laughs> Drop them at bombs. We have two. Well, they need to be appropriately okay. used. Yes, appropriately <laughs> used. They, so they we must are have epic moments. We are on our way, I guess. Yeah. Let's let's go. Do we need horse and cart? Uh yeah. You, DM said yes. Uh, well, Do we need I mean, a horse and it's cart? It's up to you. I'm saying you don't currently have one. It's up to you guys if you want to get one. Since your last okay. one was How far is place. this travel? Uh I look at the map. It'll take three days. Yeah. Uh, when to get to the mountains. Uh, with once horse you're and there, cart. Uh, with the horse and cart, it could take two days. We'll shave Is a day it... day off. 
Um, so worth it. But so worth it. getting a cart through the mountains could be treacherous. Yeah. Mm. All right, uh, no horse and cart, I suppose. Let's go. We have bad uh, luck what? with those anyway. Unless, unless I can convince a rather large group of animals to be like, "Hey, I'll feed you if you give us a ride." Brick rolls. Or, or you can uh, convince a group of animals to keep an eye on your cart when you leave it when you get to the mountains. Hey, you know what you can do? Go fuck yourself. Aw, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> See, I got a fuck to give now, too. Thank you. Mm. Um, <laughs> well, you guys all set out. Um, this time, uh, uh, go going northwest, uh, following uh, the high road, I believe. You're taking the high road. High road. <laughs> Mel never does that. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, the first day here, let's go ahead, uh, Valexia, roll a d8 for me. Wow. Ooh. Ooh. I'm good at this. Uh, yep. probably around three-ish hours of the first day, uh, thick dark clouds start rolling in. God damn it. That's a good thing we didn't there get this. There is a major uh, storm brewing that could impede y'all's progress. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, do you guys want to try and push through it or are you going to try and take some shelter? What's the plan? It's just clouds at the point at this point. Looking at, go ahead and make a nature check for me. Oh, I can do that. Uh, fifteen plus two seventeen. Hey Ivy, what was that you said? Nothing. <laughs> okay. Just checking. Taco, uh, uh, you look ahead. You've seen some pretty bad storms. This one's brewing to be really fucking bad. Like. Sideways rain. Why do I feel like this is on purpose? Like rain from Iowa. <laughs> you know what? And if that's the case, let's just go ahead. <laughs> what do the rest of y'all think we should do? Personally, I don't want the furry rat to blow away. You don't? <laughs> yeah, this is, this is going to be an enemies to lovers between you two. I feel like... I ship it. Gotta, you, the way you guys shit at each other already, you guys are gonna have like the best bromance. He's, I ship it. He's my height. It's not fair. I'm supposed to be the short one. <laughs> I think you're shorter than I am. That's the problem. That's the issue. <laughs> um. <laughs> Wait a minute. Google the uh, average height of a raccoon. Jesus fucking I'm Christ. He's a tall humanoid. He's four feet. 18 inches. He is taller than you. Taco's oh. three foot six. Ouch. That's fine. That's fine. Um, Don't worry about it. I'll strangle him in a sleep with something. So group check here. Are we are we pushing through or are we taking shelter? I'll say uh, take shelter. All right. Yep. Uh, this is essentially going to add a day of travel in, but taking shelter might be probably a pretty okay idea. Well, it's a democracy, um, so who else, who else has ideas? Go ahead, I don't think we'll do uh, Brick. Go ahead and make me a survival check. You seem to be good at finding good camps. Uh, that is 17. 17? Uh, you do find an area that kind of has um, like a, a thick wall of uh, uh, trees uh, and there is like an old uh, um, brain just turned off. Hold on. Like a stone wall that's only like maybe uh, um, just under your chest. So it's not super tall, but it's tall enough that it's going to break a lot of the wind and you guys can easily set up a camp here 
and mostly be safe probably um you guys do pull off pretty quickly after seeing the storm uh taco rolling good enough on the nature check you were able to really clock it and be like hey we need to get down so as the storm starts rolling in you guys do have already mm -hmm. sat and taken shelter um sitting around the fire to keep warm uh the storm lasts for f quite a few hours um the rest of the day and pretty late into the night as you guys are sitting around the fire um doing your best to keep dry keep warm um you notice um a fox ap approaches the camp what does the fox say <laughs> Thank you, Taco. Uh, I knew somebody was going to do it. Uh, he approaches and sits down. You notice he is not wet at all. Mommy. <laughs> What's going on? Why, um, why are you not wet, buddy? I dislike being drenched. Yeah, well, so do we. Reynard's voice. Oh, not me. Hello, my friend. Hello. I was checking up on you. Not a very good start to the travel day, is it? That's the way it is, I suppose. Sometimes, or sometimes it's not, and it was entirely planted, but that's fine. Well, sometimes... Things like this are like a roll of a dice. You never know. But it's always a good time in rainy days such as this to chat. I thought about it earlier, but all of you informed you all of his reason why he's here. I realized I don't know all of your reasons why you all dislike Mel. Though just being Mel can be a reason in of itself, I would like to know each of your reasons of being here. Adventure. <laughs> Dear Alexia, I did check up on you. You are a very interesting woman. Mm. A lucky one. What does that mean? It means the fact that you were able to come topside at all. Mm. Not a lot of your kind were able to do that. It took bravery mm. and absurd amount of luck. And I assume a deal. Hmm. Well, assumptions could be made. Yeah. Um, he gets up, walks closer, sits next to Brick. <laughs> a Brick roll, please. Um, oh, there you go, friend. Uh, set it down. He kind of munches Give me a roll. <laughs> um, but all of you, you were gracious enough to already inform everybody why you are here. I would like to know Ivy's reason. Same as everybody else. Just doing a job, right? It very well could be. He shifts into his his normal form, um, picks picks up the brick roll. Um, takes a bite and then pulls out the bottle. Um, he reaches just in front of him and there's a cup in his hand and he pours it. Sometimes in situations such as these, ones are t tempted to hold things back. I ask all of you to be as honest as you can tonight. And he passes the cup to Phylexia. He then pours another drink. 
Alexia, I may know. Would you like to inform your friends of exactly what brought you into contact with metal? Um... Well, yes, uh, yes, you can tell him. My dear, it is important to me that I hear it from you. Uh, or is this Allie telling me you don't remember? <laughs> well, isn't it? Yeah. I just want to make sure it's right. We've also been playing um, a lot of D&D on the side, and I just want to make sure that it's correct You've been with what I remember. People? You've been cheating on me? How dare you? I play around. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not hurt at all. Um... <laughs> Um, Valexia informs you all, <laughs> we'll do it this way, um, she was unhappy living in Menzo Barrens and the home oh, of, well, yeah. the home of the drow, and wished to leave. However, mm -hmm. leaving the service of the drow is next to impossible. So to do it, she made a deal with Mel to get an item that would help her. She made her way out, and ever since then, has owed Mel a favor, which she uh, yes. called in to get the gem. Now then, Rattles, I would pass you a drink, but no offense, I would rather not waste such wonderful drink. I'm told... You have very few memory. Is that correct? That is correct. What is the first thing you remember? I remember being purchased. I see. And the little one, how did that happen? 20... I was 20 years old when I found the remnants of a caravan and a four-year-old tabaxi kitten wandering lost around it. I left the remains of those in shallow graves, properly sanctified, and decided to take this one on as my own. She's been with me for four years. I see. You are a good person. I am happy to know you. He turns to Brick and hands you a drink. Oh, thank you. You, my friend, have had a rough life. I don't think it's a life. I know you learned recently that the one that puts you in the fighting pits was Mel. Yeah. I am sorry for your experiences in there. I myself spent a few decades in one. Did you have fun too? <laughs> Hugs? Hugs for uh, people? When Sleep? you ask him that he kind of gets like the thousand yard stare uh for a few moments and he then he takes a drink you could say that i suppose i made it through and i made it out just like you he looks over to you ivy and hands you a drink honesty is difficult but important. She doesn't, uh, she doesn't take a drink. She just looks at it, stares down, blinks, takes a minute to just be silent and think before 
she hesitates and then responds with, sometimes you make the mistake of caring about someone that you had no business because you were alone and that's all you knew. Because you needed something and they could give it to you because you needed help and you thought they were helping. I am sorry. And he lifts his glass to you, takes a drink. He then pours one more and hands it over to Taco. Be sure to drink it all, dear friend. I take the glass from him, stare at him angrily, and then toss the liquid into the fire as it rises. Just, just blue flame for a minute. I toss the glass back into his lap. You ask how I know Mel. Well, this is not my first party. He's killed all of my previous. Unfortunately, Tracer was the first to die. I sent an arrow that was supposed to be the end of him as he caught it in midair. Stabbed her in the throat with it. An unclosable wound as he drifted off into the ether. We got to watch her die. That was the first. The second was Kalen. Supposed to be an easy adventure. Nothing more than just getting gold. The problem with mimics is you never know when you're going to find one. And as it severed Kalen's head from his shoulders, I am reminded every night that we have a fire. As the sound of the crackling flames remind me of his bones being crushed. Vector. Vector was captured while we searched for items to heal her mother, of all things. No. He immobilized me as I had to sit there and watch her being stabbed repeatedly by goblins. The last thing her mother ever heard was her demise before she passed. But the one that hurt the most would be my wife, Maya, and the final member of the party. We had finished with all of the burials and had quit adventuring. I think at this time I was a young man. I went into town to gather supplies for dinner that night, but whenever I returned, I found her body amongst the rubble next to the bassinet for our daughter. And just as quickly as I fell in love with her, she was taken away, like grains of sand falling through my fingers back into the ocean being called home. Drowning those memories in this liquid, nothing more than a feeble attempt at holding on to a gleaming memory, like trying to stop the waves from washing our trail of footprints away from the shoreline outside of our home. But in the moment that the light left her eyes, I knew I would never be the hero that she saw me as. But I promise this, before my days draw to an end, before I embrace the fallen angels that will drag me to the depths of hell, I will be paid in pounds of flesh. The words to describe the horrors that I will inflict upon this world and to Mel have not been created yet. That is why I'm here. He looks at you quietly for a few moments. He pours another drink. And you watch a slight green glow. This will only work one drink, but I feel you deserve at least this. And he hands it to you. 
you know why I refuse to heal you completely, right? I'm aware. I am aware. He drinks with you. And it burns. But it feels good. Reynard, or Reynold stands and looks at you all. You all have become an adventuring party a while ago. I think in not much more time, you'll be able to become friends. And now that you all understand your motivations a little more, I think you may actually be the first ones to truly defeat Mal. He looks at Ivy. That is why I'm here. That is why I'm doing what I'm doing. To defeat Mel. For people like you. For people like all of you. He then steps out of the camp. Uh, on the way out, he puts his hand on Brick's shoulder. Uh, for comfort, and then on the way out, you see this this shimmer around the camp, and all of a sudden, the leak in in the tarp that's covering your shelter stops, as a magical dome is now covering your camp, and you can sleep comfortably. Reynard shifts into his fox form, and once again, disappears. Yeah, let's definitely have a group hydrate after that one. <laughs> fuck, Taco. <laughs> what happened? What the fuck? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Quick check in. Everybody good? Everybody okay? How's that emotional damage? That's fine. It's good. <laughs> fine. It was that, fantastic. That was that was the that was the backup option. The first one would have it would have been real. The first one was worse. Um You know what? Yeah. Uh, there is no demand needed that absolutely deserves DM yeah. inspiration. You take yeah. that shit. You hang on to it as long as you want. Uh, fuck. <laughs> um, Write that down. <laughs> <laughs> everyone who in chat who cried, raise your hand. Uh, <laughs> take. I'll, t oh. I'll tell everybody after all this what the original one was. But it's true. So just crap. <laughs> Tonight's gonna be a feely night. <laughs> po post stream feels. Got it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, well, you all are sitting around the fire. I After uh, all that. <laughs> I'm gonna throw my cup and stand up and walk to the edge of the woods. Um, before the cup hits the ground, it disappears. Fey magic shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, <laughs> I think you guys are the first friends that I've had. I think that's what this means. And it um, feels nice. <laughs> I was I was all alone for the longest time in the pits. I I didn't know any different. It would just push me out, and then I would play, and then they would push me back. <laughs> so it's nice to have people that are around you that make you feel safe. Thank you. You're very welcome, Brick. Thank you for traumatizing my long, my young child here. 
it is time for <laughs> Jay, Jay's just dead. sitting there like like yeah, e I'm eating a piece of bacon like <laughs> <laughs> y'all are fucked up <laughs> i send jade into the tent tell her to go to sleep <laughs> This time, you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> Just... <laughs> God damn. That did, that hit. Damn. That hit. <laughs> Welcome to trauma, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Great. Uh, I will no longer be taking any shit from anyone for this session. Yeah, uh, well, he still didn't kill somebody, so. Yeah, to be fair, Mel is the one that did all of that. So. Child, yeah. Yeah. That's you, my guy. You did this. No. Yeah, but no. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I did not write that. I will not take credit for that. That was beautiful and wonderful and absolutely horrible all at the same time. You're a horrible uh, person. That, <laughs> I hope those sides of your pillow horrible. are hot. Uh, I will say that is definitely something Mel would have done. Uh, so, oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> to the brick walks over to Valexia and says, "You're smarter than most, at least that I've met before." What? Why was? Uh, why did Ivy react the way that she did? she saw my hands, I thought you guys would be happy. Oh, um, I don't know really why. Did you, did you ask her? No, I'm scared to. She, she seemed disappointed. <laughs> can I do, can I do an arcane check on him? Uh, what are you specifically like looking at the rocks? Seeing... Yeah, just seeing if there's... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nope. Well, Ten. there you go. Yep. You can uh, sense some magic coming from them. Uh, uh, they they mm -hmm. are the remaining shards of what didn't go into Rattles' cake. So... Yeah. You, they, they do have some sort of magic left in them. Well, I think they're very pretty, and you should be proud that your skin is adorned with shinies. Thank you. Yeah. I just but, was confused. Do you want to go talk to her together about it? Uh, <laughs> I don't know. What is she, it's just, She's over there, and she's kind of just staring into the forest. She, she kind of looks like she's she's not in the mood, so... Maybe let's just pack this up and keep on, and then, um... I, I think they look great. Thank you. Yeah. As there's, like, dry you want a blood. hug? Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I give Brick a hug. Oh, thank you. Roll str... <laughs> yeah, sure. Roll strike well, check. Oh, great. Yeah, let's have the wizard half drow. No, no, Do Brick. That. We're, we're oh. just gonna see if oh. he can handle his shit. Oh, okay. 18? You handle yours. 22, 22. You very carefully oh. hug her. You, you learned from the last hug. <laughs> and you give a very warm hug. This is nice. It is nice. Like a weighted <laughs> blanket. Yes. Yeah. That smells <laughs> like roses. You do and smell dirt. like roses. Uh, that last touch in the shoulder on the way out was was a re up on the smell, so cool. <laughs> um, eventually, you all find sleep. Um, rattles as, as you kind of sit in sentry mode. Um, you notice that you don't even hear like uh, um, you you hear the sound of rain hitting the magical dome. Other than that, you hear nothing. You sense no danger. It is. A comfortable and calm, safe area that has been given to you. Um, the night passes. Um, Valexia, near the end of your sleep, um, like pr right before you wake up, 
you do have a memory of when you were when you first decided to finally leave Menzo Berenzen. And you remember the faces of your sisters. And you remember the hatred. And you remember the fear you had. If they ever caught you. That's what you, that's right before you wake up. Awesome. Yeah. The second day um, we'll have uh, rattles. Roll me a d8, please. One d8. Rolls another one. Nope, still storming, guys. Let's see here. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Two. No. Nah, uh, um, it is still raining, but it's nowhere near what it was the day before. Uh, you do get uh, uh, on a walk uh, or you get to walk words fucking <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have started with the juice <laughs> and I'm out of water so it has the juice. hey you get a good day's travel uh, uh, not hindered by storms um, there is a point in time though where uh, uh, the road has kind of been washed out by a landslide. So you start having to go out into the wooded area nearby. Wooded, swampy, mostly. Um, especially after the storm. It's mostly swamp. So, on the way through there, I would like everyone to roll perception checks. Nat 20. <laughs> Ivy, you're, you know what? You're just going to have to get your own physical dice out because roll 20 <laughs> refuses to roll good for you. You know what? No, I'm not doing this. I'm not, I'm not doing, I'm not fucking, I'm not, we're not doing this. Yep. Nope. Fair enough. Nope. I, it's, it's nope. gotten to the point where I actually feel bad. So, uh. <laughs> that 20 for brick. Hey, all right. All right. On perception. Um, um, you do, uh, uh, mostly find, uh, um, the least swampiest way through. Um, with an at 20, uh, traveling through here isn't very difficult. There's points in times where, uh, uh, Brick has to pick up, uh, Taco and, and Bartholomew, you know, because just not gonna risk it. Uh, <laughs> Uh, rattles, trash Jade, panda. Jade rides on your shoulder. Mm -hmm. And my cape, um, I make it billow over yeah, like a you, giant. Just, it, it's just a constant billow uh, to keep the, like an, like an umbrella. <laughs> I love it. Uh, because you know she hates getting wet. So. Um, oh, by the way, someone says Taco is fired because you made them cry. So. Life sucks. You'll get over it. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, um, sir. Um, as you're making your way through, uh, um, you do see some light up ahead, Brick. Like some torch light. Everyone, it looks like there's some torch light up ahead. As like you start fire. making your way through, uh, yeah guys all see right up ahead three or four burning torches. three or four what three or four burning torches being carried Did you see hmm. Hmm. Sus. super sus is it how has the rain let up? A lot, a lot. It is still raining, but it's it's just kind of it's a little more than a drizzle. Right, we're not going to spend a whole day worrying about these torches. Rattles walks right towards the torches and says, "Hello." Brick's right there with him. 
As you all start walking up, you see three people standing amongst what seems to be an altar. Oh, that's mm. safe. Oh, shit. Autumn, all you missed is uh, uh, there were some torches off in the distance, and now you guys are approaching it. Uh, Can I make a history people. check to see what kind of altar it is? This would be a religion check. <clears throat> religion? Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, let me see if that changes my mind. Nope, we're still good. <laughs> Fair enough. I lied. <laughs> uh, uh, bless no. you, 12. Uh, you're not entirely sure. You've never seen a shrine set up like this. I'll, I'll give it a go. Um, <gasps> 16? Mm. See, all we had to do is bitch about it. Mm. All we had to do is bitch. Um, you do recognize it, and as soon as the... as it comes to your mind... You hear Valexia behind you gasp. Because Valexia, <gasps> you know exactly what this is. Oh. It's a symbol of wolf. Dun, dun, dun. Three people standing are three drow, one in in black cloak. Um one in kind of like a light blue, but it, it like shifts in the darkness between this this light light blue, dark blue, even sometimes black. It's it never fully sits in one color. And then you see the white robe of a priestess of Lolf. Well, you, that's unsettling. You recognize this woman, Verenia, the head priestess of your house. You mm. also recognize the one in the shifting colored armor. Mm -hmm. This is a shadow blade. You don't know their name but you recognize the assassins. Mm. And you know what they're here for. As Rattles walks up, hello, hello. The white robed drow turns and looks. Hello, dear Alexia. It's been some time. Um, yep. You seem nervous, child. Ah, uh, just didn't expect to see any other drow above ground. Why, when one of our sisters goes missing, of course we have to find her. Uh, seems kind of pointless since I, I was never truly welcome as a half drow anyway. You know as well as anyone. No one leaves the service of love. Alive, that is. Come home mm. with us now and face your judgment. Yeah, no. I don't want to do that. I'm going to stay with my friends. At that, she laughs. <laughs> friends. Who would befriend trash like you? Well, there's a pretty cool trash panda right over here. And... <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> <laughs> He's pretty Can cool, so... Are we approaching? Uh, up to you guys, if you're still walking forward. I'll go... 
30 feet from them. 30 feet from them, so we're just kind of... Oh, yeah. Get closer. Uh, I will. I will say at this moment, uh, uh, Valexia, go ahead and give me a wisdom save. We're gonna see if you're if you're Oops. handling your that. shit. A natural twenty. Okay. Yay! <laughs> For a twenty-nine. Wow. Damn. Handled. I'll be, I'll be 30, thirty feet from the farthest one, so probably a little closer for me. Okay. I'll get. Oops. Um, you're you're not sure exactly what it is, but something about your friends standing around you. Even though you know that this situation is about as dangerous as it could possibly be, mm. you feel safe. And even though you know part of you, it, part of you knows you should be afraid, you mm. find courage instead. Mm. The one with the shifting colored armor doesn't say anything. She steps forward. She draws two blades. Uh, uh, sorry, she draws a blade and a hand crossbow. The blade itself, you all see this black, shadowy energy just start to radiate from it. Are you sure you want to sacrifice yourself like this? Not to mention the lives of your <laughs> friends. Mm. I can't speak for them, whatever they want to do, but I'm not going back. If I'm honest... I was truly hoping it would come to this. One roll initiative. <laughs> da, 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 da. So while that was happening, Brick touched his magic stone and gave himself <laughs> a gift of alacrity. All right. For, you, you uh, kinda, you, you're reading the room. You know what's about to happen. Yeah. <laughs> From his fate Sorry, touch. Sorry, reading deep. the swamp. Yeah. Um, Ivy. Did you did you go get dice? I couldn't, I, uh, I couldn't find them. What kind of nerd are you? That you I need can't you to find I, dice. I, Hurricane Carlac came through my house. Oh, you know what? Ouch. Fair. I'm not going to pick on you. Thanks. Completely understandable and fair. Thanks. Uh, all right. So, Jade. Since it's Jade, I will use the dice you gave me. Break up 21. I rolled a one. Shit. <laughs> I have something to say. I'll save it for after the game. Um, Brick, what'd you get? 21. Total. Uh, I was on there. Taco? Uh, we rolled a 15 and then plus the initiative 4. Mm -hmm. So 19. 19. Good fucking roll. Um, uh... Okay. Yeah. Water. So that's the last half. Um, Do another. Valexia. Mm. What you get? Oh, I thought I did it. You might have. Uh, sixteen. Uh, okay. Oh, you did. Okay. 
and now for them, I don't have my usual initiative random generator pulled up. But hey, look at that! Two shitty rolls and one okay one. Sounds like my rolls. Um, so, starting this off is Bartholomew. <laughs> You've been in many battles. You sense one coming. Oh, okay. You are ready. Alright, so first thing we're gonna do. Alright. We're gonna go to that leader chick that was uh, talking all that shit. Okay? Mm -hmm. We're gonna do that. What do you mean, Michael? Ah, there it is. Good job. Vicious mockery. All right. Uh, wisdom save to the three. You want to know here? Okay. Holding good. Okay. Ivy, what did you do? What? That's two ones in a row. For for what? <laughs> I've been test rolling this thing. And I can count on my hand how many times it's rolled up below a 13. Congrats, you can count. Do you want a cookie? Ooh. Oh, bricked up right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Get bricked. Get bricked. I would fucking love a cookie. Actually. <laughs> I would be fucking a, a no a no baby cookie, specifically. Then uh, roll better. Awesome. Listen, I'm rolling your dice. You made me roll a one. Bartholomew, how do you viciously mock the priestess of Lolf? <laughs> As you say this, you all kind of feel this energy um, flow out from, Bar from Bartholomew. And at first, she, she still has this this vicious smile, and, and then she kind of recoils a bit. <sighs> How dare you? Uh, she, she takes three points of damage, psychic damage, and she has disadvantage on her next attack. I still get my attack, right? Uh, so that's your action. You still have a bonus action. So you still have um, your bardic inspiration that you can do. Vicious Mockery was your attack. Okay, okay, that's right. But I strung my guitar. Mm -hmm. And I strung the G chord. Would you like to use your bonus action to yes. use the thing? Yes. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and roll your attack with it. Oh, uh, you don't have that under my attack? Oh shit, I forgot to put that on. Uh, ro roll a d20 and add your dex. Sorry, your charisma. Okay. Add your charisma. Uh, d20? Okay. I'll get that. Okay. <laughs> now 20. Tell me it's an out 20. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Natural 20. You all, as he turns, <laughs> he turns once and then he strums once more. And you all hear this choo, as a dart shoots out from from the uh, uh, guitar. Roll the a D6. Gone. Six. And then isn't your... Five, five. Shit. All right. God damn. So nine points of damage. Uh, as this dart <laughs> shoots out and kind of like hits her like directly in like the, the meaty like part of the shoulder where it meets like your chest and shit. Tip. Like like the spot where where Mark's hurting. Yeah, that. Right in the tip meat. Um. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, when you said that in the video, I fucking lost my shit. Because also, I know exactly the pain you're talking about, because I'm still in it. Um, so that just fucking happened. Uh, Brick, you're up. Taco, you're on deck. It's hammer time. 
<laughs> you see him no. punch the earth. He rages, and as he rages, he punches the earth and pulls out a massive ball out of the earth. And he said, the little rock told me to do a thing called rock slide. And you see as he just braces his feet into the dirt and it just propels him forward 30 feet into the straight line behind the back to yeah so I run through both of them and they both have to make a deck save or they're knocked prone so first one hammer alright I don't know what kind of fucking voodoo magic you did changing (laughs) dice bullshit this thing has very good decks that I don't think I passed. 13? Nope. Fuck you. Uh, <laughs> changing dice. Hold on. Give me a minute. Hollow dice. Here we go. Fuck. What's the matter, oh, pumpkin? You can't roll? Natural one! Fuck you all! <laughs> <laughs> I've been rolling Get so bricked. good. I've been rolling so good. Somebody's having a hard well, time this evening, aren't you? So those... It's okay. Performance issues. Happens to one in five. Yeah. Listen, do we want to talk about your roles? Okay. Yeah. So... Everybody's got a price to pay. <laughs> <laughs> now watch, now that you're in combat, though, you're going to be throwing natural 20s like it's your job. Um, all right. So, yeah, they are both prone. Uh, and remind me, do you go through the other one as well? And stop yeah, here? I wanted... Gotcha. When I started combat, I wanted 30 feet from yep. the last, so I knocked through both of them. Gotcha. So they are both prone on the ground. Well done. Have fun, my friends. <laughs> well done, Taco. Uh, I'm gonna move 15 feet to the left, where I'm kind of in between these two branches of this tree on the ground. Okay. Um, and then. Uh, I am going to whip out that longbow. All right. Then use. Plus one. Well, longbow. my new bow that is plus one. Correct. Uh, and then, since my fighting style is archery, I'm going to do plus two on that. I'm going to do sharpshooter, and all of them are prone. Uh, the, Those the, two. The two that brick uh, went through are prone. One Which the, one was talking shit earlier? Uh, the the one in the white robes. Well, okay, the one yeah. next to Brick. Yeah. You'll want to um, shoot the one that's standing up, though. Uh, yeah. So since they're prone, you mm-hmm. would have disadvantage to hit them. Uh, there is one still standing. If you wanted to hit that one instead, you would not have disadvantage. But attacking at a long range does not... Imp- uh, oh, that's right. You have sharpshooters, so it doesn't matter. Ha. Ha ha. Hold on. Wait a minute. That's, that's, obviously, that's totally fine with me. Uh, so you now have a plus seven. I, I went to your character sheet and I added the plus one longbow. Okay, so and work with me on this. Plus one bow, plus two. I'm doing the sharpshooter, so I take a negative five on my roll. So you have a plus two to whatever you rolled, plus two. But I, okay, so I rolled an 18, but I minus Um, five. uh, So so it would be 18 plus seven minus five. It's easier just to go 18 plus two. Okay. So a 20 does hit. Which one are you hitting? The one in the white robes? Yes. That does, that does definitely hit. Go ahead and roll your damage. Uh, and that is... Your damage would be... Uh... D10? Uh, it's a D8 plus 5. Plus 5, so 3 plus 5. 8. 8 plus 10 more because of Sharpshooter. Yeah! That's 18 points of damage. Fuck well, you talking <laughs> shit, bitch. I mean, she ain't having a good time, I'll say that. Well, she should have kept her fucking mouth shut. Damn! Say Um, less. Yeah, that just fucking happened. Gang, gang, equal Um, fights, let's go. (laughs) Let's let's do this shit. She 
doesn't even stand up. She, uh, uh, oh, is that your turn, Taco? Or? Yeah, uh... Did you want to move anywhere else or are you good right there? Essentially. I mean, we can keep, well, yeah, no, that's my turn. Okay. That's my turn. Uh, she, actually, that would be a better one. I was gonna do that, but let's do. Yeah, why not? Uh, mm -hmm. she casts darkness. So, oops, wrong button. Mm -hmm. That's just me. Do, 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 do. Who's casting darkness? Uh, is it a 60 foot radius or a 30 foot radius for darkness? Da, 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 60 feet. No, a 60 foot range. Hold on. Do, 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 do. 15 foot radius. Okay. Okay. So, uh, if you see this gray kind of circle, everything in that circle, you are. Uh, uh, is blind and none of you can see in that circle even with <laughs> dark <Except vision>. me. <laughs> <laughs> it is magical darkness and none of you can see shit inside there Rick if you, you are completely so. blind um alright that is her turn Valexia you are up Okay, they're all within that darkness? Uh-huh. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna cast shield on myself then. Alright. Oh, uh, so that's a reaction. That's... You wanna cast that, like, as you get in. Oh. Mm -hmm. I thought it was for armor class. Um, you, oh, mage armor. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can do mage armor. Yeah, that's the one you were thinking of. All right. uh, uh, shield is like, oh, you got hit, cast it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this one is... So you cast mage armor, then your AC is like 15, right? I'm searching plus its dexterity modifier. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. And then are you staying right there? Yeah, I guess so. I can't see anything, right? Not inside that dark globe. Okay. Then yeah, All I'll right. just stay. Rattles, you're up. Okay. So, Guiding Bolt doesn't require me to see. It's a creature of my choice within range. Uh... Does it? Hold on. Guiding bolt. Yes. Yes. Huh. <laughs> you know, I've never actually knew that about guiding bolt. You are right. A flash of light streaks toward a creature of your choice. It does not say a creature that you can see. You son of a bitch. <laughs> I applaud you, sir. Well, you know what? Um, for this, instead of DM inspiration, take advantage on the hit. Excellent. I'm going to throw it at that little white trash talking robe. Ooh, God damn it. You damn. all just like, fuck this person in particular. All right. Wait, what just happened? Uh, guiding bolt. Yeah. Yo! A 20, a 20 will hit. Let's go ahead and roll that damage. Bitch. Okay. What's okay, damage? Good. What do I roll? Uh, <laughs> so in the chat there, right under the 120 feet, click Guiding Bolt. Ah. How did he see his target? Guiding Bolt doesn't say you have to. Oh. It oh. just says a flash of light streaks toward a creature of your choice within range. 
That's amazing. There's probably DMs out there that would say fuck that, but guess what? This is my game, bitch. So, anyway, uh, 17 points of rating. God fucking dang. Here is here is the downside. The other effect from Guiding Bolt, where it, where it leaves a glow mark, uh, mm -hmm. um, and the next attack has advantage, that is cancelled out by the darkness. However, that's still 17 goddamn points. Let's go. Well played, sir. Well played. I am proud of you. Oh. Nice shot, Rattles. I can't see if it hit or not. <laughs> but he's moaning. <laughs> You hear a yell of pain. I think you got him! <laughs> uh, all right, all right. Uh, is that your turn? Are you staying right there? Oh, I've got or... a bonus action. I'm going to also cast Spiritual Weapon and just send the kitty in. All right. Uh, so you cast it kind of on the edge here. Um, you do remember that there was one kind of like on the edge there. Mm -hmm. on the ground uh you can go ahead and roll for the attack uh so here's the funny thing with them being prone it would be advantage but with darkness is disadvantage so it's just a straight roll and you fucking rolled 25 <laughs> what? where's what? these rolls for me and ivy where where is this yeah fucking all right then <laughs> fuck me i guess um there's like, so there's like a foot sticking out of the darkness and the cat just starts like biting and mauling the, the foot. <laughs> Fucking, all right then. Um, uh, it's that person's turn. Uh, they are going to use half their movement to stand up. How? I've got their foot. Well, it... <laughs> Not mechanically, unfortunately. Oh. Um, but don't hurt that cat. You remember what happened last time? Hey, th this is this is a spiritual kitty. I can keep it's it a spiritual all I want. kitty. Um, <laughs> it's a specter. So, is it a bonus action? It is a bonus action. Aha! Uh, as a bonus action, it it kind of it looks like it takes the shadows around it. And the next thing you know, it is standing directly behind Alexia. Mm -mm. Uh -uh. So, changing dice again, because fuck my life. Fucking shit. As a 13 to hit. And with your mage armor, I believe that misses Alexia. And then, okay, that, that'll probably hit. 18 to hit, Alexia. Uh, so that is... Six, so... That is three... Eight points of piercing damage. And... Ow. Uh... Eight. 14 points of necrotic damage. Yeesh. What the? Uh. Owie! You are now covered in a five foot cube of darkness. Gelatinous cube? Nope, just darkness. Okay. Have fun. Like being in the underdark over again. Yeah, pretty much. Um, next up, Mage's turn. Um, shit. Well, fuck that set up. Right there. Okay, computer, you need to listen to me. Thank you. Um, first things first, they're in the darkness. All right, <laughs> they step out. Uh, <laughs> going to cast a uh, lightning bolt. 
Rattles and Valexia. I need dexterity saving throws from the two of you. Uh, Dex. Oh shit. Valexia, you just barely succeed. Uh, and Rattles, you succeed as well. So the two of you are going to take half damage. Uh, give me one moment. I don't want to do math, so... So it would be uh, 13 points of damage to the two of you total. How you looking, Alexia? Hmm. Still alive? <laughs> I can fix that. Um, it's Jade's turn. Stab a bitch. <laughs> of course, I get a natural twenty. <laughs> of course, of course, because I'm attacking. I'm attacking me. Whose dice was it? Now, was it? Like, so now. It, was it Ivy's mm -hmm. dice? You no, bet it was. It was the sparkly green. <laughs> and I throw it down, and I get another natural twenty. All right, sure. <coughs> Whatever. Let's go. Uh, math again. Ten. Fourteen points of damage. Just turns around and just pulls her knife out and stabs this bit right in the thigh. Just, <laughs> just right in the right thigh. Right in the thigh. The meat. Um. Uh, and then she will bonus action disengage and fuck right off uh, over to Taco. So, uh, Ivy, we'll go ahead and do your turn real quick. Damn. I have one action, right? Uh-huh. And, uh... Fuck Nugget is still behind Valexia. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Damn. Decisions, decisions. Okay. Welcome to my world right now. I, I kind of got it pretty <laughs> fucked up too. So. All right. Okay. 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 I would like, at this point, to. We have a mage left. The one behind Valexia. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Uh, uh, real quick, she stepped back in the darkness after her turn. My bad. Mm. I've got the mage. Don't worry. So I uh, I would like to use let's see, how far how far am I from the mage? Thirty feet. And how far would I be able to move? Thirty feet? Well, unless you go through this water. Go through the water? Not with you saying it like that. Uh, can I jump that far? Jump 30 feet? Maybe. Or at least over the, no. the water? No, probably not. Uh, maybe. You have to I don't run. like that. Go ahead and try. You have to do a uh, running start. It's, it's 25 of 10 feet. feet. Hold on, I need to see how From far. Uh, uh, oh, shit. Uh, I moved you. My bad. No, it's okay. Um, I'm trying to from figure where out. You, are, you can get you can get a good run and start, and, and maybe. No, you uh, can't. <laughs> with the with the rolls with the rolls I've been making, I don't trust it. Um, I don't I, think I, you need to jump. I would like to make it to the corner of the darkness on the safe end of the water, so that All I can right. clear just enough space to get about ten feet away. Give me an athletics check. 
Oh, fuck me. Okay. Please at least be more athletic than anything else. Oh my fucking god. Natural one. Damn. There it is. Uh, you take off. Ready to get like a running start. You step right on the edge of the pool. No, 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 I wasn't jumping the pool. You, you weren't? I was not. I was walking around the edge. Oh, you were walking. Or, okay. Oh. Oh, I said okay. that. So that gotcha. doesn't need an athletics check. Uh, no, it does not. Okay. <laughs> so you can get right here in the darkness, but then you're in the darkness. Right. That's fine. Okay. To that space, how far am I gen generally from the mage? You, you, to, uh, about maybe 10 or 15 feet. You're not entirely sure. All you know is they stepped in the darkness here. Awesome. I'm using Earth here. I'm using Earth Tremor. It doesn't fucking matter. I'm going to shoot for it. You son of a bitch. Okay. All right. I don't need to see to fucking rock their shit, okay? Okay. Is it a deck save? Uh, let's see. The must. Yeah, everybody's got to make a, a deck save. Everybody within 10 feet of you? Yes. Okay. Oh, that's the spiritual weapon, Jade. Okay, so that, that doesn't. Fuck you. <laughs> right. But it wouldn't have been she she didn't have to make that roll. I thought she was jumping, jumping across. I that was, was not jumping. that was mine. Yeah. Um you you did it didn't look very graceful as you walked. How's that? Uh, um you're <laughs> yeah, like here. sloughs into a mud puddle. That uh, tracks. Um yeah. Um yeah, they both failed. I don't want to talk about it. Mm, yeah, yeah, did, did they? So uh -huh. that also means that that affected the edge that they're near, right? Yeah. I will admit, because I am also on the edge, that could have affected me. I'll give you that. Yeah. But it sure as fuck affected them. Yes. I'll take it. Uh, you know, I, I'll give you a deck save. Okay. See, we'll we'll go we'll go fifteen. What is what is her turn? Oh, oh, no! oh motherfucker! How's that, Daddy? What's up? You hear a splash. Uh, and this person who stood up now falls back down. Both of them also take one d six bludgeoning damage and are knocked prone. Go ahead and roll that bludgeoning damage. Goddamn right. Twice, one for each. Up, up to you. One for each. So one to okay. the priest and four to the other one. Oh no. Uh, and then four, and then they fall into the water. Mm. Uh, you, you hear a, a sudden like scream. Oh. And then you hear nothing. Was that rushing water like a river? That is, it's like a pool. Um, this this green kind of uh, dark pool. Okay. However, uh, as your turn ends here, we'll end the episode here. Oh, as it Why? is just past ten thirty. In the middle of a fight. You can't. You can't do that. You can't do that. Come on. It's not gonna Would take you much. all like to keep going and finish? Yes. It? Yes. Yes. All right. Fair enough. Uh, okay, <laughs> Bartholomew. Uh, it is you once again. All right. Well, I want to do my spoon. You want to uh, spoon this bitch? Yes. Against right. the uh, yeah, the first one. Yeah. A natural fucking 20. Oh, damn. Spoon. What is happening, Roll20? Calm your shit down. <laughs> I, didn't I tell you, Ivy? Like, we're, we're oh, you're gonna roll like shit, and then all of a sudden it's combat, mm -hmm, and you're there. Mm -hmm, anyway, mm -hmm. fucking go ahead and roll that damage. So his spoon. weapon is a literal spoon? Yeah. Spooning oh. on the battlefield. Uh, he, he, he takes out a ball. Well, you can... 
describe what you do. So I have a little spoon, and it's a it's it's a fucking fancy spoon. It's like it is a gilded silver fucking shank. It's sharpened on one end, but uh, it has a, a special uh, magic ability to where whatever I put in it and I fling, like you know, you fling peas at the kitchen table. That shit is like supersonic and does extra damage. Hence the ball bearings, you know. I'm oh, clicking yo. Steel peas. The spoon is okay. His uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I, I will say, since it is uh, 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 a ranged attack, you would have to step back to not get disadvantage on it. It still have that natural 20. Um, real quick. Fuck you. I rolled a two to hit you. Okay. It, it, that happened. Uh, so as you step back, this the shadow blade just cut like swings in front of you, and on your back foot you launch it, <laughs> uh, uh, hitting him like directly in the center of the of the chest armor, and that shit like dents in a little bit. <laughs> um, fuck. Glad you're all getting nat twenties. Glad everybody's rolling great. Glad it's yep. it's going wonderful. Uh, wonderful. <laughs> Uh, you still have your bonus action, so you can use your Bardic Inspiration, or what? you can... Hmm? Yep. True, true, if we need it, yeah. Yeah. Uh, remember, Tank, the, uh, for yours, it is use it or lose it. Yeah. Um... Alright. Yo! Oh, oh, oh hey! Military, Military foe. foe! Just gave a hundred subs. <clears throat> Thank you! Bro. Bro. Bless. Nice. Thanks. Uh, I don't... Um... What do we do for that? My guy. <laughs> what a, My uh, guy. Maybe guest spot in a DM, like in a guest spot in a future game or something? I... Uh... He aww. does play d and I'm gonna need a minute for that one. And you wanted to stop. Yeah, you wanted you know to what? stop. <laughs> I'll drink to that. Uh, <sighs> dude, I appreciate you. Thank you so yes, much. Thank you, you know what? An extra giveaway. How about that? Hey, get his information. Cause he, yeah. He yeah, he sincerely. Some we yeah. have some stuff for you, sir. He's a friend of mine. I can find he him. He is? Yo, yeah. when, we have, when we have his information, I really appreciate you, man. You're great. You're wonderful. Holy fuck. I'm gonna not be okay for like 10 minutes here. Um, uh, uh, distract myself with D&D. Uh, oh, action. Oh wait, he did it. <laughs> Crying it's is fine. a free action, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> uh, Bartholomew, bonus action. Would you like to use uh, your Bardic Inspiration or fire a dart from your guitar? Uh, I think <laughs> I'd like to do... Uh... Uh, unsettling words is my bardic in inspiration. Oh, shit. Ooh. Okay, okay. Go off. So, yeah. Uh, give me one minute. Choose one of your creature. Yeah. See within 60 feet of you. Roll the bardic inspiration. Die. Creature must subtract the number rolled from the, from the next saving throw it makes before your start next turn. Okay. So what are your unsettling words? Uh, so I hit her with the spoon and I flung the peas at her. So I'm going to say, and it did to her armor. Yeah, right in the center of the chest piece. I'll say the ball bearing is like in there now. <laughs> ha ha! I buried my balls in your chest. Oh my god. <laughs> that is quite unsettling to to... A drow, actually. I'll I'll fucking give you that. <laughs> well played, now sir. Uh, so yeah, they have. Fuck you. Okay. All right. Brick. Uh, so. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, it's still dark, right? Yeah, you cannot see even the hand in front of your face. But I have tremor sense. You do have tremor sense. <laughs> Within ten feet. <laughs> so you are fully aware that the priest is laying on the ground in front of you. And I, 
Okay, so I'm going to recklessly... Oh wait, I don't have to reckless because it's an advantage That's yeah, already an advantage because they're on the ground. You're welcome, baby boy. Thank Hammer time. you. That is a 27 to hit. Woof! This may surprise you, but yes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh uh, man. You're getting waylaid right now. That is <laughs> hey, man. that is 14 total damage. Jesus fuck. Alright. You hear the cracking of bones. Ooh. And I will reach down with my free hand and grapple on them. Alright. Roll an athletic <laughs> check at advantage. You're getting hugged with one hand. That is a uh, 19 athletics check. Beats their 13. They are grappled. Stay the down. Zero. Stay down. God damn. All right, Taco. So he's, hmm. They're now restrained on the ground and can't yep. move. And can't get up. Oh, so, do they make a con save oh, for oh, their yeah. dexter? Or yeah, uh, for, for the, the darkness. Dark. Yes, thank you. You son of a bitch! <laughs> Hammer time! The uh, as the darkness fades away, you see uh, this person <laughs> on the ground. Um, th like, there is blood coming out of her mouth. It looks like her ribs have been caved in. She's still alive. <laughs> Kinda. Maybe she shouldn't uh, be and, and Brick's, so much just, shit. Brick's oh. just holding her down. Can I down. move? I can move. See? Yeah. You got half I'm going to speed. drag her over to the water. You're good. And let go. Oh, <laughs> my boy. My baby boy. I'm so proud. You give her a little toss. Time for a swim. She she can't even yell because Damn. of what you did to her ribs. Oh, you probably boy. punctured a lung. You hear a splash. <sighs> you watch bubbles uh, come up uh, along the water. Too many bubbles. More than there should be from a single person. They're just playing in the water. It's just a swim time. <laughs> Taco? Fuck. Uh, Boy, uh, that uh, follow that up, sir. <laughs> that thing. You know what? All right. Uh, I'm going to use my sharpshooter feet. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to use my... Uh, Arcane Archer and Feebling Arrow. Yeah. The one. The last one standing. Uh huh. <laughs> All right. Uh, no, we're not going to add anything to it. Uh, 18. Uh, so. So 18 plus 2? Plus 2. Yeah, 20. That Okay. Damn. Uh, oh, oh, where is it at? Uh, then it's Creature hits by the arrow, takes extra 2d6 necrotic okay. damage. So roll a d8 and 2d6. <laughs> That's five yeah. on the d8. So we're up 10 plus 10 is 20. Uh, three on the first roll, and a fucking six on the second roll. 29. Damn. Get Whoa. wrecked. Uh, and if they just so happen to still be alive, everything is halved from them until the start of my next turn. God damn. Get wrecked. They are quite wrecked. Yeah, um, get wrecked. Okay, okay. <laughs> cool, 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 cool. Roar. Cool, 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 cool. Is that your turn? Uh, are the other people still alive? You no. have no idea. They have not come up out of the water. That's not safe. That's I don't like the bubbles comment earlier. That's, 
Mm -mm. I don't like it either. Mm -hmm. Which. Uh... Uh, are they still alive? The one I just hit. Yeah. They're not looking too great, but they're alive. I'll end my turn. <laughs> I'll save that. Okay. Uh, it would be the priestess's turn. The bubbles continue. <laughs> until, they, <laughs> until they abruptly come to a stop. <laughs> Alexia. Oh, I think I'm fully knocked out. I just found my hit points finally. I was at 17, so. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah, you're 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 down. I'm all good. Uh, Rattles, you're up. Oh. <laughs> um, I'm Alexia going is to. Alexia unconscious at your feet. Okay. So, all right, I'll use that as a bonus action then. But uh, first, I'm going to cast Command. Oh, jeez. The remaining drow. Okay. Whoops. Did I not cast that right? You did. So I have to make I, a save. I have to make a saving throw for that. So oh. saving throw. Now, I also, because of Bartholomew, I have to minus... Uh, where's, I had it. Where'd it go? Right there. His, uh, his, uh, yep. So, their oh. wisdom, I can close that stat block, and I can close mm. that stat block. <laughs> pieces of shit. Uh, <laughs> That's okay. Nice. Okay. Fuck you, Nick. <laughs> Be I would have made it. Too. I would have made it, but I rolled a six, Norse. <laughs> Subtracted six. I would have made it. Good job, little red man. Yes. What a dick. <laughs> uh, what do you? Com what? What is your one-word command? I point at the water where her friends went and say, "Swim." I, oh, no! I fucking knew it. I fucking knew. <laughs> Water's nice this time of year, isn't it? Mm -mm. Mm. Another series of way too many bubbles. For What's one, two, three, four, five seconds. And the bubbles stop. And then I'm going to use my bonus action. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Healing word. To healing word the body at my feet that you said. Gotcha. So, Alexia, you wake back up. You're no longer at the feet of the assassin. Yay. Uh, as you wake up, that darkness around you that was left by the shadow blade uh, goes away. How much healing do you give? Rattles? Um, I have to cast it? Yeah, so it'd be a d4 plus your wisdom. Oh, d4 plus wisdom, so we go over here. D4. So that is a four. four. Yeah. And then your wisdom's plus four, right? Yeah. So you get eight points of healing. Yay. Nice. As you wake up, and then Thank you. the shadows around you dissipate, and you lose twelve points of he of hit points. Woof! Back down again. So you wake up long enough to go, oh, thank you, and then you're unconscious again. But rattles, you're right there, and we're not in <laughs> combat anymore. Oh, we're not. Okay. So you can go ahead and. So I'm gonna do. Is she dying? <laughs> she she, she woke up for a sec, and then she was back out uh, as the shadows around her uh, uh, like dissipated, and they looked like they tore something f from her. Okay. Well, just to be safe, then I'm going to cantrip spare the dying before I begin my prayer Fair of enough. healing. Good turn. Yeah, let's all huddle by rattles and get some 
nice. This was an extremely point. deadly encounter. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, was it? That assassin still had seventy-seven hit points. The mage still had forty-one. How much did the one that went for a swim have? Six. Oh. Six left. <laughs> Six left. Started with 71. You guys wrecked their shit. Get um, bricked. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> oh, someone did minions or minion arrive. Ivy, give me a deck save. What? Oh, <laughs> someone did minion arrive right at the last moment. Thanks, Professor. Professor Fun Times. What just what's going on? Please, 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 please. Are we in combat again? Oh. An 18? Mm-hmm. Um, you're watching the bubbles, and something in the back of your mind just says, back the fuck up. Oh. You do. And these leech-like creatures. Oh my god. Crawl up to the edge real quick, right oh. where you were. No! Uh, uh, no! And you, no. you look at their circular mouths just filled with teeth. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Oh my um, god! Uh, but they don't stay out of they they can't come out of the water for very long, but they do come so they do go back in. Hey. Why do you think they really try to jump? Oh, please, 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 break. Baby! Wait. What? Do I get advantage on this type of deck save? Yes. Yes. Because you're bringing your chance. The leeches are the minions. That's 15. 15? <laughs> uh, you take 13 points of damage. What kind? A, a, a few of... Uh, uh, it would be, pierce, uh, be piercing and then necrotic. So, nine points of damage. Um because it's half for you. Uh, the leeches jump out and like latch onto your foot and then your ankle. Uh, I'll and they're all do over you. reaction absorb elements. Okay. So that necrotic is halved. Mm -hmm. So that would so be. Uh, we'll do five. Okay. Five points damage. All right. Quick and clever. They're still on you. Uh, I'm going to squish. So I'll, I'll, I'll let you just you, you just take the hammer the hammer fist and just uh, interesting note as he does this he is smashing his own leg We're, we'll say you, you take four points of damage Calculate. Uh, total you also notice as he's doing this Ivy he's not reacting to either the pain of the bites nor the pain of him bashing his own leg those things are annoying I, I, I would I would like to cure wounds, but not make a spectacle of it. Okay. Uh, you go over and do that, and that... That is where we will end this. Uh, uh, Rattles, go ahead and roll your prayer of healing. Uh, we'll get that real quick, so Alexia will be conscious at the beginning of the next session. Now, what do I do to do the prayer healing? 2d8? Uh-huh. Uh, plus your wisdom. So D8 two eight plus four. Two, so that's thirteen. Thirteen points of healing to you, Valexia. Uh, Is that anyone group? else that needs like, it? Yeah. Thank um, you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm alive. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm alive again. <laughs> <laughs> dead. <laughs> uh, well, thanks everybody. Uh, for playing. That that was fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah, that was. Yeah. I was hoping somebody what? would go in, the, go in there. There was the two. Water. I had to say it twice. Uh, um, being in the water, that's 5d10 damage. I trust nothing you set up. Good try, mm -hmm. though. <laughs> that, Imagine if you fell in the water. Like you're trying to jump. He was trying to make you jump across it. He <laughs> And you had a natural one? I wasn't making them. I was going to let them. You were encouraging it. Yeah. And then, oh. I still, but see, I took a risk. I still could have fallen in the water using my own yeah. tremor. I took yeah. the risk for you guys. I you took did. the risk. You did. <laughs> you could have It would have been bad. Yep. Um, Thank you. Yeah. If if the shadow blade hits, 
Um, uh, when the darkness is dismissed or dispelled, it does 66 necrotic damage. I rolled oh. shit. Um, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, ain't it. Cool. <sighs> well, I don't trust you anymore. Uh, Luckily, we threw them into the water. <laughs> <laughs> or had them jump. That was pretty clutch there. Good job, yeah, Rattles. Good job. Good job with the Bardic D inspiration. Yeah, fuck you all. <laughs> no, that was a, that was a good one. That really was. That was. It, it had a plus six, and I rolled a six. I said it twice, because <laughs> yeah, there were, there was two five thousand bits. So I said it earlier. And then I just said it again. At the end, yeah. <laughs> I missed it. Well, damn it. I missed it. That just means we have to do it again next time. Well, you heard oh, me yeah. said it because you echoed exactly what I said. <laughs> well, fuck. Okay. How many, well, how right. many you did say that. Sorry. drinks did you say? <laughs> I've been drinking. Uh, so. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Well, uh, for the giveaways. Yes. Uh, the production remind me or like uh, we we do it now. We announce like what are we doing? Daniel. <laughs> no one told me how the giveaways work now. <laughs> Night. Hell. Well. <laughs> holy shit. Well, uh, <laughs> we will. Uh, uh, I believe they. Uh, we, we were going to do it like on stream here still for the simple reason of like being able to get a hold of people last time was kind of a bitch. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, and real quick, Norse, before we forget, you did mention um, oh, we're doing the drawings right now, but Norse, you mentioned that you had a special giveaway at the end. You're muted right now, buddy. Sorry. Yep, there I am. There I am. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna do one of my uh, uh, one of my roll for cake and big sticker packs. Oh shit! Yeah. All right. All right. Well, uh, which ones are we starting with here? Which giveaway are we gonna start with? Indeed. There's the Misty <laughs> Mountain gaming gift cards. There's the big yep. roll for cake dice, and yeah. All right. God damn, we're having a whole bunch of people. I didn't realize how many people were in there. Gotcha. So the twenty-five dollar gift card for Misty Mountain gaming gaming goes to. This, the suspense is killing me. Lady Cass. Holy shit! Lady Cass. Aww. So you get $25 uh, code you want to show the for the mount. Sorry, my brain yeah. turned off again. $25 wow. gift card to Misty Mountain Gaming. Yeah, listen to the promotion. Yeah. Uh, Next. We will, uh, be DMing you, uh, Lady Cass, the code, and that one will be yours. <laughs> Next up. The $50 gift card for Misty Mountain Gaming. Let's fucking go. Huge shout out, by the way, to Misty Mountain Gaming. Thank you so Lady much. Cass. Oh, yeah. Won the giveaway with a 2.14% chance to win. Wow! Silence, Silence 318 won the giveaway with a 2.14 chance to win. There's a main one, but you can say we'll give them a bunch. 
Oh. Oh, there we go. I didn't know about this. Hey, 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 hey. We're even cooler than I thought. Look at that. So, the big dice. Yeah, let's do the big dice next. From Dark big Crescent dice. Studio? Studio? Dark Crescent, Dark Crescent Studios. Studios, yep. Dark Crescent Studios, they, follow they them found, on... They found me on, uh, so they watched on YouTube, and they commented, and they're like, hey, you know, I'd like to do a giveaway, and I'm like, fuck yeah. it, message me on Instagram, what you got? And they're like, I want to make a roll for cake dice. A G big honking D20. Fuck yeah, let's do this. Uh, AK Frozen sure 87 this. won the giveaway. Repeat of that the Dark Crescent Studio roll for cake dice. Chunky Girl, boy. Seven. You win the chunk boy. Hell yeah. Let's go. Yeah to be, yeah to be. What's next? What's next? Tacos dice? What's Taco mm -hmm. doing? Tacos dice. Tacos dice and dice back. Oh. With a dice bag. You wanna show the dice real quick? Which one are you were you doing? such a pain getting these things in here i know right <laughs> because i y'all want the little what do you put the miniatures or whatever uh, on top of these things which i don't understand yeah is oh, the influencer thing you do the uh, Dark Crescent studio is in the chat they they want to let everybody know that is a 40 millimeter d20 chicken chunky, chunky boys. boy chunky boy she's thick and very beautiful. Thank you, yes. Dark Crescent. Appreciate you. And Fallen Sky Shadows. Wins That's a cool Tacos outfit. Dice. With a 0.85%. What? Wow. That's Holy fantastic. Shit. Well done. I love that it tells the percentage of the chance. I didn't realize how many people were in these giveaways. Holy shit. Fallen Sky Shadows, you won tacos dice that he played with today and shot a wicked freaking awesome arrow of 29 damage congrats <laughs> Fuck my shit up with that goddamn <clears throat> jesus really oh i'm also putting other stuff in here that is secret and nobody will know until he opens them or they happy open surprise them. happy oh. surprise for fallen sky shadows we'll just we'll just put a little happy surprise in there it has a little surprise. surprise 468 total tickets. Huh. And the last Norse giveaway, what was Norse doing? A uh, pack of stickers. Roll Beautiful. for cake stickers. Roll for cake stickers. The first stickers to go out. First roll for cake. Weaver 87. 67. Weaver 67. 67. Uh, wow. Okay. Uh, that, uh, 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 Congratulations to all, all yeah. the giveaway winners. Congrats. Yeah, congrats. They, uh, we will have more next episode, so. There are more giveaways. And I believe, Autumn, if, if you want to you do that photo package thing, I, be oh, yeah. I believe the people earned it. Autumn they did. Worked. Were they you did. doing the, the Carlac thing on the weekend you mentioned? Oh you yeah. Put that so out there now? Oh, I yeah. will be I will be at PAX East as Carlac for Larian Studios uh this weekend. And I will be opening up my cameo to offer custom Carlac cameos for people. It is a limited run, so just a heads up on that. Get them while they're hot. There uh, you go. Well they will sell fast. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fucking tank, Jesus. Uh, you worked hard all weekend, man. One more group hydrate. Fuck it. I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm not gonna I use my tinkle. <laughs> well, uh, I would once again like to thank all of the players. Um, special thanks to Taco for that monologue. Fuck that Beautiful, shit. beautiful. Fantastic. Uh, not a dry eye in the audience. Drama. Drama. Yeah. 
Uh, Great. All players, you guys are wonderful. I'm glad you're here. Um, everybody in the chat. I, I don't know what to say tonight. I'm still fucking floored. Thank you. Yes, thank you. I don't. Thank you doesn't feel like enough. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, the military fox. It just. Thank you, everyone, for being here and enjoying the show. Uh, we just kind of do this for fun and, and and to give people entertainment and some special giveaway stuff. Uh, anything we get out of it, it from from you guys is just a bonus. Uh, we appreciate you all. Please have a wonderful night and be kind to each other. Okay, bye. 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 bye.